We don't need the introduction. Welcome. Welcome everyone. Yaho. I'm Rinkusissimo, linker of nature and civilization. And welcome to Persona 4 Golden. There we go. Okay, um, I test uh, this game. Um, I don't think there's any issue. If anything, there will be in the cutscenes, but as long as it's fine, I don't even need to talk doing them, so it's fine. I hope. In any case, uh, okay, wait, uh, let me change one thing because I have the audio language for uh, Japanese, but I think I'm going to set it to English. Basically, um, because it will be a bit confusing if I have to read everything uh, while there is a voice, right? So I'll just set it to English, even though I like it in Japanese better. And, and I won't have to read as long as they uh, talk, you know. Alright. Uh, no, I don't want internet, thank you. Normal, yeah, that's not easy nor hard. I think I, yeah, I can change it anyway, so it's fine. Let's just start with normal. I think it, it should be fine, like that. So let's just start. I think first is a cutscene. Oops. Oh. Oh, hello, dear. Oh, hello, dear. <laughs> Who are you? Welcome to the Velvet Room. Thank you. That was very nice of you. Although this doesn't look like a room, honestly. Ah, it seems we have a guest with an intriguing destiny. <laughs> that will be me, yeah. My name is Igor. Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. So polite. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Nature and civilization. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. Okay, hey, wait, wait a minute. I haven't seen anything, you know? It may be that such a fate awaits you in the near future. But I haven't seen anything. Now then, why am why I here? You introduce yourself? I, why am I here? Okay, uh, last name, okay, last name. I will be Susumu, right? I mean, it's a Japanese game, so it makes sense that this last name goes first. Susumu. Uh, yeah. What? No! <laughs> okay, uh, wait! Okay, there we go. Okay. First name, that will be Rinku. Yep, that's me. I don't know if the volume is alright. When mm, when I test the stream, uh, the volume was a little bit low for some reason. But I think it should be fine, right? Now, let's take a look into your future, shall we? Okay. Whoop. One of my sisters do, do you this as well. believe in fortune telling? I don't. Actually, I don't. Each reading is done with the same cards, yet the result is always different. That sounds like bullshit. <laughs> Life itself follows the same principles, doesn't it? 
What are you talking about? Hmm. The tower in the upright position represents the immediate future. It seems a terrible catastrophe is imminent. And why necessarily a terrible catastrophe? The card indicating the future beyond that is... Mm -hmm. The moon. The moon Tsuki. in the upright position. Mm. This card represents hesitation and mystery. I feel like Very I'm, I'm being called out indeed. here. It seems you will encounter a misfortune at your destination, and a great mystery will be imposed upon you. Is that a threat? In the coming days, you will enter into a contract of some sort, after which you will return here. Okay, but if I have to sign a contract to be here in the first place, why am I here when I haven't seen anything? The coming year is a turning point in your destiny. If the mystery goes unsolved, your future may be forever lost. That makes no sense. My duty is to provide assistance to our guests to ensure that does not happen. Oh, thank you. That's the nice of you. Ah, I have neglected to introduce my assistant exactly. to you. Please. This is Margaret. Margaret. She is a resident of this place, like myself. And she's also my future wife. My name is Margaret. I am here to accompany you through your journey. Will you accompany me through my journey in life? Forever? We shall attend I'll to take the details that as a yes. another time. Until then, farewell. Okay, you're kicking me out now. It wasn't that a, like a limousine? Shouldn't, shouldn't it be called like the velvet limousine? Oh. Okay, I don't think I should be. Could you guys close your eyes? <laughs> close your eyes right now. Tired of diets. Enough with going to the gym. Good thing there's something even I can handle. <laughs> yeah, screw the gym. Slim down this summer. With the refreshing taste of calorie magic. And we're back. Now on to some juicy news. The Mayumi Yamano scandal. I'm sure everyone is <laughs> At first he bags a singer, then he has an affair with a TV announcer on the side. Do chicks really dig politicians? Isn't it just stuff like money and connections? When you get down to it, financial and political clout is what matters. Hey, what is that supposed to mean? Well, what do you think? That's the Japanese, by the way. <laughs> well, I'm sure that you all know already, but at the end of this month, he will be transferring to another school. I have a name. Quiet down, guys. I'm not done yet. You didn't even mention my name. That's really rude of you. What do you mean, he? I have a name. Passengers headed for Inaba City and Yaso Inaba Station. Please go to the other side of the platform. The scandal involves the Enka star Misuzu Hiragi preparing to tour Misuzu. overseas. Taro Namatame, a council secretary in the Inaba mm. region, whom she married just last year, is now under suspicion of having an affair. What's more, his rumored mistress is the well-known TV oh, announcer. Ms. Should Mayumi we go Yama. soon? Yes, just about. Right now, this is just an anime reaction. Oh. What was that? A reaction to anime. What is this? My wife. I was my wife. Yaso Inaba. He doesn't did say Yaso Inaba there. 
I could read that. Okay, finally, end of the cutscene. Now it says, uh, Hachi you there, Eki. Hey, over here. Uh, but I can read it all, I think. It says, uh, uh yeah. <laughs> But Hachiyu is literally AT. Weird. Hello, who are you, Mister? Well, you're more handsome in person than in your photo. I know. People tend to say that. Welcome to Inaba. I'm Ryotaro Dojima. I'll be looking after you. Okay. Pleased to know you. Let's see. I'm your mother's younger brother, and that about sums it up. Okay. Thanks for a brief. Okay, wait. I'm lagging. Why am I lagging? <laughs> hey, Annie Sally, thank you for following. Wait, hold on. How are you doing? <laughs> wait, hold on. Uh. Hello. <laughs> How are you doing? Thank you for coming. I hope you enjoyed the stream. Okay, hold on. Uh, I should find a way to make this automatic or something like that. <laughs> I'm fine. Thank you. Uh, oh. Okay. Sorry. Sorry about that. Lost frames there. Um, I'm fine. I'm, I'm glad that you're doing well. Hmm. I hope you enjoy it again. And for some reason, why? I don't know if you can hear me alright, but OBS is lagging a little bit, so. Okay. I don't know you. It's nice to meet you. Huh. You probably don't remember, but we've met. I've changed your diapers before, you know? Oh, yeah, the, the, the usual thing to say. I hate when people say that. Stop. It's this fine, a little. My dog. Oh, it's okay. Okay, that's fine. Well. Uh, when I tested, uh, it gave me no bugs or anything. It's kind of weird. Come on, Nanako. Introduce yourself to your cousin. <laughs> I mean, I can always uh, lower the settings. Hello. It's the volume alright, by the way? Because I'm not sure... <laughs> what are you so shy for? Ow! <laughs> <laughs> well then, let's get going. Uh, I think I can. My car is over there. Oh, I can. I can. Oh, hello. Hey. You drop this. Oh, hello. What's with this game? <laughs> it's not mine. No, it's yours. I saw you drop it. Are you stalking me? You're stalking? Okay, since you dropped it. But well, did I? Whatever. All I did was pick it up. My, what's wrong? You could you could have said bye, you know. She's pretty, but she's kind of mean. Moil, 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 kyun. I'm not going. I'm not going to. I'm not going to say that. <laughs> Okay, uh, Inaba Central Shopping District Gas Station. Hi, welcome to Mole. Why are you voiced? You're Can literally you go no to the one. Bathroom by yourself? No, I can. Uh huh. Oh, okay. It wasn't. It wasn't me. <laughs> I 
It's in the back, to your left. You know which way's left? The side you don't hold your chopsticks in. Your voice kinda doesn't fit you, honestly. I know. Jeez. <laughs> Are you taking a trip? No, we just went to pick him up. He just moved here from the big city. Tokyo. A city, huh? Fill up my car while you're at it. Regular's fine. Right away, sir. Good time as any for a smoke. He's kind of unnerving, I don't know. Are you in high school? Why are you asking so many questions? Leave me alone. Does it surprise a city boy to see how little there is out here? There's so little to do, I'm sure you'll get bored fast. You'll either be hanging out with your friends or doing part-time jobs. Speaking of which, we're actually looking for part-time help right now. Convenient. Give it some thought, why don't you? We don't mind if you're a student. Oh, I should get back to work. Yeah, bye. Why doesn't anyone say goodbye here? Like, see ya, or anything like that. Are you okay? No, I'm not. Did you get car sick? Yes, I did. You don't look too good. Well, thank you. You don't look too good either. Could it be exhaustion from the long trip? Now that she mentions it, you feel a little dizzy. <laughs> now that you talk about it, hmm, yeah, What's I kind of feel sick. Okay? Uh, I'm just tired, I guess. That's understandable. It must have been a long trip for you. Why not take a little walk? Get some fresh air. Just let me know when you're ready to go. So I'm telling you I'm feeling dizzy and you say, yeah, go walk. What's with everyone here? I'll wait here, why don't you take a... Yeah, I just said that already. Okay. Mm. Time to... Um... Okay, let's go with low. I don't know what this is. I don't know what an isotropic filter is. For now, let's uh, change this. Let's see if it that's better. Uh, no. Okay. Uh, look, I don't know what it is, though. Like, honestly. Uh, still not. Okay. Okay, anti-aliasing. Oh, I don't know what it is. But... And still not. Okay, well. <laughs> okay, we think of... I don't know what it is, but... And still not. Wait, what? Are you kidding? Wait, hold on. No, it's still... I, I don't know. OBS is um, bugging for me, but I don't know if there's any repercussion in the, in the stream itself. So what if... Hmm... No. Here. What if... I turn off the shadow. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think it will make any difference, though. Uh, okay. It seems like that's actually better. Or never mind. But I can I <laughs> I can change anything at this point. Um. An isotropic setting reduces blurriness and visual artifacts in the distance. Oh, okay, that could be convenient. That could be convenient, actually. But what if I turn it off? I don't know at this point. Uh, 
is it still is it still buggy? I don't know. But I can't do anything else. I literally didn't have this issue when I uh, test the stream. So I don't know if it's just OBS being dumb or what. Like, can you hear me when, when I'm talking? I hope so. Also, the um, anisotropic uh, thing will be really useful, actually. Oh, you can hear me? Okay, then it's just OBS being dumb. Okay. <laughs> Okay, that's good to know. Thank you. How should I call you, by the way? Should I call you Annie? Is that is that all right? Uh, okay. Let me turn this on. And then answer immediately because I play game too. Ah, it's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. Okay, I, that should be fine. Okay, hello! Hmm, have we met before? Yep. Yeah. You were really mean back there. I met you just now. I met you just now. Just now? Hmm, okay. The girl is thinking to herself. Wow, okay. Okay, let's uh, save, I guess. Hmm. So, should I. Jumi Night. Jum, 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 jum. Wait, that's. Four. Okay, yo me. But isn't that me? Weird. This is a bookstore. It is fairly empty inside. Yo me onai the bookstore. I see. Dai Dara Metal Works. A fierce looking man is single mindedly pounding on something in the back of this store. What is he pounding on? You decide not to enter. It seems like it's something private. Okay. Let's get out of here. <laughs> you have something to do in this shopping district. It's a bit run down, but we have everything here. It used to be a lot more prosperous back in the day, but we only see regulars nowadays. If only Junas hadn't come into town, it's convenient, but it's a little sad. What is this? Marukyu Tofu. Mm. I can't... It's a Maruku tofu shop. An old woman is standing in the store. Okay. Who are you? Hey. Do you go to my school? Hey, do you know where my snack went? I had it in the fridge, but it's gone. Oh, I ate it just now. I thought it was leftovers. <laughs> what? No, it wasn't leftovers. I was making sure to save it for later. Oh, really? Sorry about that. Well, I'm going to work. See ya. What I was really looking forward to eating it. They seem to be having a sibling dispute. You should leave them be, okay? Can I? No. What is this? Capsule machine. Shiroku store. A variety of products lines the shelves. A friend, a friendly-looking old lady sits behind the counter. Hmm. What about you? Mm-hmm, I like this shop. It's very nice. It's inconvenient and convenient at the same time. There's a delicate balance. Yeah, it's uh, really charming, right? This is what I expect country life to be like. There's some charm to it. Oh. Okay. Let's go. How are you feeling? Ready to get back in the car? Can't I go walking? Like, it's a, it's a town, right? It should be fine if I go walking. Alright, let's hit the road then. During events, press back left button to see the log and skip event button to skip the event entirely. Okay. What? Dog. Okay, that's a nice house. You arrived at the Dojima residence. For the next year, this place will be your home. Why only a year? Afternoon, evening. Okay. Good evening. Oh, sushi. All right. Let's have a toast. Oh. 
butter toast. No, I like that one toast better. So your mom and dad are busy as always. They're working overseas, was it? No, are they? I know it's only for a year, but getting stuck in a place like this because of your parents—they left for an entire year. It's rough being a kid. Well, it's just me and Nanako here, so it'll be nice having someone like you around. So long as you're here, you're part of the family. So make yourself at home. Okay. Mm. Yes. <laughs> no. Thank you for your kindness. <laughs> Come on. There's no need to be so formal. Oh, screw you. <laughs> Look, you're making Nanako all tense. Yeah, it's my fault. Blame the new kid. Well, anyway, let's eat. Oh, who's calling at this hour? Dojima speaking. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I see. So where is it? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right, I'm on my way. Oh, you're leaving. Looks like I made the right choice to skip the booze. Every adult around me is busy. What the hell? I should have Sorry, gone somewhere else. I gotta go take care of some business. Go ahead and eat without me. I don't know how late I'll be. Nanako, you help him out, okay? Okay. That's embarrassing. Nanako, it's raining out. What did you nope. do with the laundry? I already brought it in. All right. Well, I'm off. Bye. <laughs> well, time for sibling bonding. Well, you're like my little sister right now. For this week. Next, let's take a look at the hourly breakdown of tomorrow's weather. With storm clouds moving in from the west, expect rain throughout the day tomorrow in most areas. Let's eat. Okay. Uh, you might want to strike up a conversation. Uh, what does your dad do? It must be tough. It must be tough. It's always like this. Damn. My dad's a detective. Okay, so it really doesn't matter, right? The, whatever I chose, it, she was going to to tell me the same thing. And now for the local news. Oh, it's surprising that uh, this kind of town has like a local channel. City Council Secretary Taro Namatame is under fire for an alleged relationship with a female reporter. the first time you play Persona? Uh, not really, uh, but I have not much experience with it. I would like to play Persona 3, whatever version there is, <laughs> and also Persona 5, but I had not the pleasure to. I did play Persona 4, I'm just playing it because it's the one that I have, basically. But yeah, I wanted to stream it anyway. And let's see if... I don't really remember much of it, honestly. I played it a long time ago. When I... I think I played it uh, when it launched on on Steam back then, yeah? So I don't really remember a lot. His wife, Enka Ballad Sensation Misuzu Hiragi, revealed to this station that she will likely pursue damages. I don't know if you want to know about Persona 4 have multiple ending if you want to go for all. Oh, that sounds interesting. But isn't Persona like super long games? It will take me such a long time, right? To get all of the endings? Maybe? I don't know. <laughs> so, I don't know. I'm not really a completionist. I would like to, to get as much as I can. My television uh, has decided to cancel for example, when I played uh, Nidhi Streamer, I remember I tried to get as many endings as I could. But uh, Persona games are really long, so maybe I will stick with uh, whatever I get and maybe the true ending. Hmm. But they are two main ones. Oh. So yeah, there's like a true one, right? Until 
allegations I want to get that one Mr. at least. She'll remain off the air so and if I don't succeed, I may go for that one. This is boring. You're too young. At Tunis, every day is customer appreciation day. Come see for yourself <laughs> waku, waku. and get in touch with our products. Every day is great at your Tunis. Every day is great at your Tunis. <laughs> She's so cute. Aren't you going to eat? First time player are more likely to get the neutral one. Hmm. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, if I do get that one, uh, I can easily... Wait, is it is it raining? I think it's raining outside. Uh, I could just go for the true one, right? Easily, maybe. I don't know. I actually don't know. I have no idea. Like, I'm being honest here. I have played Persona 4 before, but I, I honestly don't know. Okay, what to do now? Oh. Okay. Should I go to my room? I don't know. Every day is... Uh, wait, how was the song? <laughs> This is the room you're borrowing from Dojima. Epic. Work table. What for? You're tired from the long trip. You should rest. Am I sleeping at the sofa? Oh, I am not. Oh, okay. I thought. Yes. You'll be living in this town for one year starting today. You wonder if everything will be all right. School starts tomorrow, you should hurry to bed. Um, it's just a small town, I'm sure nothing bad will happen, right? It's just a small, cozy town. Hmm? What's this? Man, am I handsome? Oh my goodness. This is the area is covered in a thick fog. The fog. All you can do right now is proceed forward. Is this Silent Hill? I do be walking. I do be running actually. Do you seek the truth? I guess. You heard someone's voice. How can I... Oh, I can move the camera. Okay. If it's truth you desire, come on, find me. You hear the voice from up ahead. Who's talking? What is this? You send someone ahead. Will you continue? What? Okay, that's a door. <laughs> cool. Cool door design, I guess. And all of a sudden I have a katana for some reason. So, you're the one person me. <laughs> Try all you like. Okay. Hmm. It seems that you can see a little despite the fog. What if I... What if I defeated this guy? I see, indeed, that is very interesting information. Wait, I have skills, but you will not catch me so easily. If what you seek is truth, then your search will be even harder. Oh. Oh. The surroundings are covered in a thick fog. Okay, can I use a skill? Zio Cleave Rakukaya. Eh? What does this do? Increase one ally's defense for three turns. Deals light face damage to one foe. Deals light elect damage to one foe. 
Okay. Okay. <laughs> I just summon a persona for some reason. Everyone sees what they want to, and the fog only deepens. <laughs> Will we meet again? At a place other than here? <laughs> I look forward to it. You are losing consciousness. I need to go to the Pokemon Center. Hello? You can hear someone's Breakfast voice. Breakfast ready. Oh. It's almost time to get up. You felt like you had a nightmare. What could it have been about? You're starting school today. You should head to the living room for now. Okie dokie. Oh, that's a toast. Good morning. Okay. okay. This breakfast is very American, if you ask me. Let's eat. Uh, do you do the cooking? I can toast bread and cook sunny side up eggs in the morning. Dad can't cook, so I buy dinner. You're oh. starting school today, right? Yep. My school's on the way, so let's go together. Okay. Nanako seems somewhat restless. You decided to head to school with Nanako. Yay. School zone, Samegawa, flute plane. Flood plane, sorry. Uh, okay, Gawa means river. I don't know what Same means. I know uh, Same means shark, but that's probably you not what it means in this here. in this case. My school's this way. Bye. Bye. <laughs> well, okay. Oh, thank you for the follow, Luca. I hope you enjoy the stream. Uh, first time run. Uh, well, I played Persona 4 before, but it's been a long time, so I don't really remember a lot. Hmm. I hope you enjoyed the stream. Please make yourself comfortable. <laughs> oh. <laughs> In any case, even, even if I played it... Um, <laughs> for Josuke. Uh okay, yeah, Josuke is this guy, right? Um even if even if I play this game, please make sure not to make any spoilers, okay? So uh for people watching the stream, you know. Hmm. I play a lot of times. So you like it, huh? It's it's one of your faves maybe? Hmm. I remember I liked it. I, I think I do like the Persona games, but I had to play more of them, honestly. I, I love to play uh, Persona 3 Reload. Hmm. We should let him be. Bye! <laughs> I don't want to be associated with you. Don't worry, a friend is playing it in stream, so I never do spoilers. Oh, okay. Well, so you're watching two streams of Persona 4 now. <laughs> you arrived at the main gates of Yasugami High School. What kind of student life awaits you here? I wanna play Reload, my PC can run it. I don't know if my PC can actually run it. Even if I could run it, I probably wouldn't be able to stream it. Which is a shame. So I never saw other Persona except for... Oh, you haven't. Well, the most uh, famous one is uh, Persona 5, right? Well, actually three. French girl. You and a friend who almost never starts stream. <laughs> well, that's honestly surprising. Uh, wouldn't play. Wouldn't people play more often? The one that just launched. Because this one's uh, fairly old, right? Uh, talk about bad luck. The homeroom teacher here is Moroka, isn't it? Yeah, it's King Moron, oh, all King right. Moron. We get to enjoy his long ass sermons every day for a whole year. <laughs> hey you guys, I heard there's going to be a transfer student from the city in this class. I'm going to bully you for your boys. I'm sorry. Huh? Really? A guy or a girl? <laughs> That's the important question. 
A transfer student from the city. Just like you, huh, Yosuke? Oh. Huh? You look dead today. <laughs> Maybe because he got hit. Uh, personally, the cast of this game is my favorite. Felt uh, like true friends that you could have in real life. Yeah. I do remember um, something like that. I yeah, I think I really, it. I think I really like the characters, but I, I can compare the cast to the other games, mm. obviously. So, shut up. I got notifications all of a sudden. I don't care. What's with him? I like the fact that all background characters have normal uniform. Then there is the main character. It's like you know that meme in which it's like. Uh, can you find the main anime, uh, the, the main anime protagonist in in this photo? And it's Who knows? all normal people, and then someone with a very weird hair. I think it, it was Yu Gi Oh actually. All right, shut your traps. Oh, you're looking good, man. You're really pretty. Is that I'm someone Kinchiro please Moraoka, play tic tac toe your on... homeroom teacher from Wait, today tic -tac -toe, forward? Is it? Tic tac toe on his forehead, please. <laughs> Wait, can I can I do that? First things first. Just because it's spring doesn't mean you can swoon over each other like love struck baboons. <laughs> and then the MC has a uniform without changes except the jacket open. That's true though. <laughs> Long as I'm around, I don't need you anything different. Be I just pure look as great the already. Snow. Now I hate wasting my time, but I'd better introduce this transfer student. This guy needs a surgeon dentist. Uh, this guy looks like in in a cartoon when when someone tries to eat something really hard. <laughs> this sad sack's been thrown from the big city out to the middle of nowhere like yesterday's garbage. So true. And he's just as much of a loser here as he was there. So you girls better not get any ideas about hitting on him. He knew people will hit on me. Like, I can't blame him. Tell him your name, kid, and make it quick. You calling me a loser? Say that to my face. Oh, my courage increase. <laughs> That's it. You're on my shit list. Effective I wouldn't dare to do that in real life, so I have to do it here. Go, now please take off the up. pain of me slowly dying in the middle of class. You have guts. Because, yeah, because it doesn't affect me personally. <laughs> Basically. This town is miles away from your big city of perverts, perverts and assholes assholes? in more ways than one. You'd better not even think of getting involved with the girls here. Let alone abusing them. Eh? Is that something usual here, or? Man, I I sure hope I don't get banned when I upload this VOD on YouTube. But what do I know? It's not like the old days. Even here, kids grow up so damn fast. Every time I turn my back. You're fooling around on those damn phones, checking your life journals and your my places. Okay, Boomer. Excuse me, is it okay if the transfer student sits here? Oh, I already been hit. I've already been hit on. Look at that. Huh? Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Hear that? Your seat's over there. So hurry up and sit down already. Look at look at the way he walks. He's the worst, huh? If you haven't seen the anime of this game, you should do it after you finish this. It has very funny moments and some extra lore. Oh, I should, yeah. Maybe I should. Rotten luck for I'll you get stuck in this. Write it down. Well, I have, we just have many animes that I want to watch year. actually, so and too little time. Being an adult sucks. <laughs> You can hear people around you talking about you. Eh, of course. Sucks to be the transfer student oh. ending up in King Moron's class on the first morning here. Oh, but they're not talking about me. Yeah, he won't think twice about suspending you if you get on his bad side. They're not talking about me. They're talking about the teacher. 
Then again, we're all in the same boat. And now they are talking about themselves. Shut your traps. I'm taking roll, and I damn well expect you to respond in an orderly manner. Your life at this new school has begun. I, I saw he was going to say something like, your life at this new school sucks. Will you be able to fit in here? Yep. Uh, the typical extra long list of anime to watch and keep adding more and more. And you just don't watch it. Yeah, and the same That's goes for, for the today. games, actually. Normal lectures will start hmm. tomorrow. Luckily, because I stream, uh, my list of games I want to play keeps going down, so that's that's good. <laughs> okay, um, I'm seeing, I'm seeing repeats here. There, we have repeat students. Like I'm, did, okay. Uh, wait, hold on. Um, I'm going to make the cursor visible so I can point it. Okay, there we go. I think you can, well, yeah. Okay, so first we have this one and this one. And then this girl here and this girl here too. What's the odds of having two couple of twins here? <laughs> That's all for today, okay. Oh, more twins. Attention all teachers. Please report immediately to the faculty office for a brief staff meeting. Oh. All students must return to their classrooms and are not to leave the school until further notice. I mean, I didn't leave the classroom. Ugh. You heard the announcement. Don't go anywhere until you hear otherwise. Huh. I'm going to leave, I don't care. Because I'm that cool. He's seriously getting on my nerves. Brown hair girl, which one? <laughs> there are like three. Did something happen? Don't those sirens sound really close? Hmm. The police? I wonder if something happened, huh? Ah, I can't see a damn thing. Freaking fog. I don't know if this is the police or the ambulance. Yeah, like every time it rains lately, it gets all foggy. Hey, did you hear? I hear that paparazzi's looking all over for that announcer. Huh? Oh, yeah. You mean Mayumi Yamano, right? I heard some guy spotted her at the shopping district. Actually, I heard that. Um, actually. Are you serious? Um, uh, you could have to say that loader so I can hear you. Uh, hey, hey, Yukiko san. Mind if I ask you something? Is it true that announcer staying at your family's inn? I can't discuss such things. Yeah, I guess not. <laughs> then why do you ask? Are you dumb? Oh, sheesh. How much longer is this gonna take? I wouldn't, I wouldn't complain if I were to miss class, honestly. There's no telling. I should have left before the announcement came on. By the way, did you try what I told you the other day? You know, that thing about rainy nights. Huh? Oh. No, not yet. Sorry. Ah, uh, that's okay. What are you talking about? It's just, I heard a guy in the class next door yell something like, My soulmate is Yamino, the announcer. <laughs> Delusional. Attention, all students. There yep. has been an incident inside the school district. Police officers have been dispatched around the school zone. Understandable. Please stay calm and contact your parents or guardians as soon as possible and quickly leave the school grounds. Imagine, imagine like an announcement like this. It, it goes like, hey, someone died here, but please remain calm, okay? Do not disturb the police officers. Head directly home. Okay, you don't have to tell it twice. I repeat. Yeah, I, I, I said you don't have to say it twice. I, I want to leave already. What? Something actually happened? Come on, let's go take a look. <laughs> In rich United States Day. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> hey, are you going home by yourself? <laughs> hey, boy, pissing all by yourself. 
uh, I was going to say, um, what if this game will be like, you know, uh, in Phoenix Wright, for example, in Ace Attorney, that they pretend to be in the United States when everyone knows that's not true. Like, hey, I want to uh, eat this hamburger and it's just a ramen, a ramen, a ramen, ramen shop. Like, come on. Oh, nearly forgot. I'm Chie Satanaka. <laughs> You know, Average all friend. American day, Latin and North American. Yeah, okay, fair, <laughs> fair. And that's how um, I get hated by all of America, just in one go. <laughs> um, yeah, of course. Wait, <laughs> okay, <laughs> you do? Dude, I was sitting right next to you. I even talked to you. Anyways. I'm sorry, I don't remember you. This is Yukiko Amagi. Hello. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm sorry that this is so sudden. How did you mean sudden? Introducing someone? Come on, don't apologize like that. It makes me look like I got no upbringing. I just wanted to ask some stuff, really. That's all. <laughs> uh, um, Miss Satanaka. Miss? This was really awesome. Like, the way they moved was just amazing to see. What are we talking about? And I'm really sorry. It was an accident. Please just have mercy until <laughs> just my next paycheck. He's about to get murder. See ya. Thanks. Stop right there. <laughs> what did you do to my DVD? <laughs> like the demons followed you. Ah! Well, most like... Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Where did she head? What? It's cracked like that. Oh, my trial of the dragon! I mean, she looks like a demon, actually. I <laughs> so... think mine's cracked too. <laughs> Critical hit to the nads. Oh my goodness. Okay, I like this guy. Uh, Poor are thing. You all right? <laughs> oh, Yukiko-san. Are you worried about me? I mean. It's hurting me too. He's fine, Yukiko. Let's ditch him and go home. Well, okay, Chie is kind of mean. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> These nuts. <laughs> it looks like he's in a lot of pain. Of course, he got kicked in the balls. You should leave him be. Um, you are better than this. Come on. <laughs> You're Yuki, right? Y Yuki? You wanna go hang out somewhere? Yuki? What? Wh who are you? By the way, Yuki means ice. Fun fact. What's up with him? What school is he from? I, I love the fact that they literally came running here and they stopped and they're like, who is that? It's like, hey, let's go look at him. Never mind that. He's going for Yukiko-san? Man, you'd think he'd at least wait until she's alone to make his move. I bet you a can of Tappy gets knocked out. Tappy? Tappy? What is Tappy? No bet. Haven't you heard how difficult the Amagi challenge is? The Amagi is? challenge? Yuki's more common use oh, for snow than so ice. Oh, are you coming oh, or true, not? Oh, true, true, true. Yeah, my bad, my bad, yeah. Yeah, 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 true. When it rains, it's Yuki. Yep, it's true. My bad, my bad. I, I'm Good not one, Luca. Going. Fine. <laughs> I didn't want to date you, anyways. <laughs> All of the girls what, are the what same. What did he want from me? What an incel. What did he want? Uh, obviously he was asking you out on a date. Huh? Really? You really <laughs> had no clue? Then she. But then again, that was way over the top. It was creepy how he called you Yuki, Yuki all of a sudden. <laughs> Yo, Yukiko-san. Turned down another lovelorn fool, huh? Her name is like Chill of Snow or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Because Ko uh, means like kid. It comes from Kodomo. I I believe 
And it's actually a really common part of a female name. Man, in Japan, you're cruel. I mean. You got me the same hmm. way last year. I don't recall doing that. I think that. it's cute, actually. Whoa, are you serious? So then you want to hang out sometime? Oh, there is. <laughs> he he got that raise. I'd rather not. Oh, he doesn't. He didn't get that raise. That'll teach me to get my hopes up. He got two hard hits in such a little time. Anyways, you two better not pick on the transfer student too much. What? Isn't that you? We're just curious, is all. Um, uh, and the two I'm guys are still looking. You into this. <laughs> oh, there are there are more people now. Come on, let's go. Everyone's staring. Why are they staring though? We are not doing anything. We are just standing here. Like, bro. We are just standing there, and people is like, <gasps> "Wait, are they really standing there? Like, oh. nothing's going on." So you came here because of your parents' job? <laughs> I <laughs> thought it was something way more serious. <laughs> there really is nothing here, huh? That's what makes it nice. But there is nothing much we can show to people from outside. Though there is something from Mount Yasagami. I think our dyed clothes or pottery or something is kind of famous. I think. You're not even sure about what your town is famous for. Oh, wait! And there's the Amagi Inn! Yukiko's family runs it. It's the pride of Inaba. Like Inaba, very calm little town. It's better than where, where I live, actually. <laughs> I'd rather huh? live there than it's here. just an old inn. No way! Because you know, I live in a I live in a town a that's treasure. um big enough to be considered a city, actually, but it is basically a town in, in the way people behave. There are barely anything to do, even though it's a big town, and people is just like you know, it's that town attitude. I don't know. I don't really like it. So it's not good as a city nor as a town. It's horrible. It's a great inn. It's been going for generations, and Yukiko here is gonna take over someday. Oh. Their inn actually attracts a lot of visitors. So is she Inima. rich? It pretty much keeps this town going. I don't think that's entirely true. What is it? So tell me. You think Yukiko's cute, huh? Oh, I knew it! I gotta be honest, okay? <laughs> Um, a middle point between Zid and town. Yeah, but in this case, it's not like Hannah Montana. It's not the best of both worlds. <laughs> it's the worst, actually. Come on, don't start this again. She's really popular at school. Yeah, I, I saw that. Boyfriend. Kind of weird. Huh? Kind of weird. Maybe she is an into men. What if all of a sudden she said, Chie, I love you? I would prefer don't respond just in case Chie will kick me or make me uncomfortable. Okay, that's a fair point. Come on, stop it. I had to say it. I'm sorry. I had to, I had to spit it out. Y you shouldn't believe that, okay? It's not true that I'm popular. Do you like tomboys? That I've never had uh, a well, it depends. It depends. I don't, I'm not really into things you know um i like uh, women that could be tomboys that could be gods that could be normies you know as long as i like everything else about her you know what i mean so i could like a tomboy yeah the way tomboy is a woman that is like masculine right that's what you that's what you mean right 
wait, no, no, no. What I meant to say was I, I don't need a boyfriend. No. Jeez, GA. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. But this is our chance. You like women who are women. The big city. I can I can like masculine women too. I always say it. I like women that could kill me. Nope. Ugh. Where's the bomb button? Wait. Mm. Hmm. Yep. Good try, bot. <laughs> Good try. Good fucking try. They make me throw the F bomb. I just did too. I usually hey, just say truck. That? Truck you, bot. Track you. What? Okay, that reflection is so High real. Schooler left school early, and as she came down this street. Wow, who could imagine that hanging from an antenna? What was hanging from an antenna? I wanted to see it too. Oh, you got here too late. The police and fire department took it down just a moment ago. I'm wondering who will be the girl that to go to a relationship or if you are going to the harem. Harem. Hmm. I'm not really into harems, actually. Not gonna lie. I'm a loyal man. Well, I think it's terrifying. I can't Can I go for Margaret? Because here. I really like Margaret, not gonna lie. <laughs> Wait, what did she just say? That I said, I want to, uh, I want to do as many social links as I can. Hey, what are you doing here? Good luck. Oh no, is it difficult? Did something happen? Well, you could say that. Okay, I did say Bad that. Principal. We told him not to let them through here. You know this guy? They didn't say that, to be honest. I'm Detective Dojima, his guardian. Uh, no, well, but only is something about time this? limit. Oh, no. I hope you get along. <laughs> I hate that. But you three really ought to stop wandering around and head straight home. Limited actions per day. Oh, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> Too much for him. Adachi, how long are you going to act like a rookie? You want to be sent back to the central office? I'm sorry. <clears throat> <sighs> go wash your face. We're going to go around and gather information. I want to marry Margaret. I mean, she's was my wife already. announcement was a... What do they mean? It was hanging from the antenna. It's very probably that you are gonna love Adachi, the people that puked, and Josuke. I'm I really loving Josuke, honestly. Hey, I love Kiko, goofy characters. Why don't we go to Juness some other time? Juness. Good idea. Good idea. It's All always right, a good idea to go off. to Juness. Also, starting tomorrow, neighbor. Uh, let's do my our town. Best. Has that one shopping mall, super big shopping mall, and then uh, in the in the town itself, the city itself, there are barely any big shops. They are they all are local shops, which sucks honestly. They are very bad. Most of them don't work. Yeah, you're gonna love both of them. Oh, that's great. I love, I love uh, goofy characters. I love them so much. They tend to be my favorites too. You just had to head away from the crime scene. Okay. Cool. Okay, where to go? By the way, um, I'll, I'll ask again. Um, is the volume alright? Can you hear me alright? Can you hear the the game alright? Or is it too loud? Too too loud? Please let me know if there is any issue. Hmm. 
The okay, perfect. Oh, it's alright. Okay, great. Okay, let's go to... Juness. I want to see Juness. The voice on the game is perfectly... Okay, great. Thank you for letting me know. Okay, is this it? <laughs> okay, this doesn't look that good of a place. I'm waiting for my dad. He's here. He's blah, 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 blah. Shut up. I heard something happen, but what? Uh, okay, I think I should go home. Hello. You must be a student at Jasugam High. Uh, it will be terrible if anything happened to you. So, okay. Uh, I understood the message here. It's been... Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. OBS says that I've been streaming for half an hour? What? But then I look at Twitch and it says it I've been streaming for one hour and ten minutes, which is actually true. That's weird. Yeah, well, anyway, uh, didn't the stream didn't get uh, divided or anything, right? Obviously, it's very weird lately. Yeah, that is true. I mean, it's bugging a lot today, so. Okay, Ooh, hello. I was terrible. I was doing some work on the farm and the police came around to question me. It's such a dangerous world these days. I can't even relax when I go out shopping. And I was going to buy some tiny salt tomato for dinner tonight too. What now? Well, that's no problem. Here you can have some that I harvested from my garden. It's no big thing, anyone can start a home garden long as they have some unique land to work with. Wait, hold on. Okay, it's because okay, it's because OBS gets um buggy when when I'm playing the game for some reason, so it's just that the timer didn't didn't move at all. <laughs> we are Yes, I mean, okay, um, español es mi idioma nativo, yes. <laughs> oh my, is that so? If they start a home garden too, does that mean I can look forward to them sharing the vegetables they grow? That's why my English may be weird sometimes. It will become evening, e evening. When you return home. Yes, I, I have no other option, to be honest. So I've been streaming for 1 hour and 12 minutes in 13 minutes. I wonder if Dad and I haven't... Home again tonight. Haven't... Um, I haven't even got my persona yet. <laughs> so it is that long. I'm less moving fluid in English. Cualquiera diría que estoy siendo nativo. Oh, thank you. You flatter me. I've been... Uh, okay, well, I'm going to translate that. Sorry. Um, you speak English fluently. Anyone will say it's your native language. Uh, I've been, I've been speaking English ever since I was a kid. I practice uh, since I was very young. So, so yeah, I think at this point I got it. Basically perfect, evening, but this is still not my native language, so summer. it is natural that I make some mistakes. Hmm. I think. Around noon today, a woman was found dead near the I'm Samegawa French River though. in Inaba. Can uh, I'm sorry, Annie. Can I can I bully you from for being French? You know, I'm I'm I speak Spanish. It's my native language, but because I'm from Spain, so you know, uh, Spain, France. There's like that kind of. R r wait, how is that word? We are kind of rivals right <laughs> no but i'm joking i'm joking i'm mostly joking mostly <laughs> uh, 
Where are you from, Luca? It's like a bad international joke. Call this be the incident you heard about? The deceased has been identified as Miss Mayumi Yamano, a 27-year-old announcer at the local television station. The initial results of the Inaba Police Department's investigation have revealed... <laughs> the, the, the Inaba Police Department! That's where Dad works! Oh, smart. <sighs> Ecuador. Oh. Yeah, that's interesting. It must be really hot there, right? <laughs> because it, that's like the middle, the, like the middle, and that's in the center of the of the globe, right? Or is that a myth? Are you worry about him? It'd be all right. I know. Oh, that's his job. So this stuff happens. Well, like uh, the One Piece fan base is starting to call us lately the Lunarians. <laughs> okay, that's a great one. Because I'm I'm a One Piece fan. It's my favorite anime. Okay. The body was found hanging from a large television antenna atop a local resident's roof. Hmm. Oh wait, actually, hold on. I'm dumb. I just I just remembered. I haven't updated this. <laughs> Okay, let's continue. Authorities are uncertain as to why the body was in such a state. With the cause of death also uncertain, police continue to investigate whether the death is an accident or a homicide. Yeah, I usually hang out around antennas and I trip and I die there, you know? A thick fog common to the area has slowed their progress and plans to fully canvas the area are delayed until tomorrow. It seems that the local TV station's announcer was found dead near the Yasugami High School campus. The announcer, Mayumi Yamano, the affair with a local councilman's secretary had been on the news just the other day. They found her on the roof? That's scary. Can we change the channel to put something better for Nanako? Yeah, right up. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> oh, it's Juness. <laughs> At Juness. Every day is Customer Appreciation Day. Okay, come see on. for yourself and get in touch with our products. <laughs> the timing. <laughs> the timing is the most important part of a streamer. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, there we go. Every day is great at your Juness. Every day is great at your Juness. Okay, I had to. <laughs> I can for some reason I can change my expression when I have the game uh the game's window like open, you know. I don't know exactly why, but I can. Your Juness. You memorized it already? Well not really. <laughs> I'm the best one in my class. I'm the best one in my class. Do you do, do, do competitions of Juness or what? Nanako sings the song to herself over and over. Oh, what did I do? What have I done? A smile we must protect. Yes. She's so cute. Okay. Hello. When is Dad coming home? Nanako keeps looking towards the TV with a worried expression. You should leave her alone. Oh, what? Well, okay. Meh. <laughs> what? Take that back. Annie, take that back! <laughs> Wait, I haven't checked this place. Can I cook? Because it isn't used very often, the kitchen is organized. If there were ingredients in the refrigerator, you might be able to make lunch. Ooh. Okay, it says... Tamago. Okay, that's um, a carton of eggs. <laughs> nope. Wow. I didn't expect this from you, Annie. Okay. Nothing catches your eye. Nothing catches your eye. Nothing catches your eye. Nothing catches your eye. It's like... <laughs> uh, tip, it's very probable that the first two dungeons will be very difficult, especially the first boss. Oh, Neo. You're still tired from getting used to your new life. You should return to your room and rest. 
Oh, you're forcing me too. Okay. Okay, I'll try my best. I don't really remember anything. Well, again. <laughs> Someone. <laughs> Rolling student. Maybe you should help him. I can look away from this at this point. You saved me. Oh yeah, that's right. You're that transfer student. Yeah, Rink is using well, that's me. I'm Yosuke Hanamura. Nice to meet you. Is your bike okay? My bike? What about me? I don't care about you. <laughs> Yosuke seems to be alright. Say, did you hear about the incident from yesterday? They found that announcer lady hanging from an antenna. I think it was some kind of warning. There's no way something that weird could have been an accident. What? Really? You mean you think it wasn't an accident? But it I think it really looks like one. <laughs> no, I, you might be right. Come on, let's be honest. A dead body over a roof like that? That's just messed up. Then again, it's pretty messed up to kill someone in the first place. Well, yeah. <laughs> New clip. I should clip oh, that. Crap, we're late. <laughs> you want to ride? It's a little squeaky, but it should be fine. Nothing got you, you're right. Oh. <laughs> okay, you clipped it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Midnight raid to the freezer. <laughs> yes. I mean, isn't that like... I, I think everyone went through that at some point, right? Okay, be quiet, you idiots. You guys are in high school, aren't you? Can't you just shut up during class? No, I can. Don't you have any common sense? First of all, my job is to waste my precious time teaching, blah, blah, teaching you assholes philosophy and since I'm so nice. And I'll straighten up your rodent attitude while I'm at it. Aren't you honor? And I'll be going especially hard on any of you morons that that were curious about the murder. Got it? Now get your box out. You listen to lecture intently. Your knowledge has increased. But I ha I didn't learn anything from that. What? Okay, well, I won't complain. So, are you getting used to this place? Uh not yet. Yeah, <laughs> well, you just got here. Yeah, of course, it's my second day. There isn't much to do here compared to the big city. But there is that certain something you can't get anywhere else. The air is clean, the food's great. Oh, Especially you know about the, food. the local delicacy? What local delicacy? It's grilled steak, man. Oh. <laughs> like that's anything special, huh? For some reason, I thought you were going to say uh, Jukiko. I know a place where you can get it cheap. Want to come? You helped me out this morning, so it's on me. I'm fresh piggies. <laughs> what about me, huh? No apologies? Yeah, that's what uh, the country has. Vegetables and fruits, probably. My trial yeah, of exactly. the dragon! <laughs> you always come around when I'm talking about food. <laughs> I think How you guys like food. Go? Don't you think he should treat us too? Yeah, she's a rich one, right? I'll pass. Oh. I don't want to gain any more weight. I need to help out at the end today anyway. Wow, Yukiko-san. You started training to take over the business? It's not like that. I'm just helping out when it gets busy. Well, as long as they pay you. Well, I should be on my way. My. Oh, well. We should get going, too. Okay. Huh? Do I seriously have to treat two people? Yes. Junis. <laughs> where every day is the great. Cheap place you were talking about? Ugh, <laughs> they don't have grilled steak here. Okay. Yeah, well. Once you hopped on the freeloader train, I had to change my plans. <laughs> Still, that's no reason to take us to your place. What do you mean your place? You live here, just get first the trash, now the food court of a uh, shopping mall. Dude, this isn't my place or anything. Oh. 
Oh, right. I haven't told you yet, huh? I moved here from another city about six months back. Oh, but I knew about that. This location just opened up and my dad was assigned to manage it. Oh. So our entire family came out here. Hmm. Here. So it's like a chain. This is to welcome you to town. Sadonaka, yours is on me too. Yeah, I know. <laughs> okay, but there are only two plates of food. That doesn't add up. The conversation became animated over small talk. It's only uh, been half a year talk. since this place opened up, but I haven't been to the local shopping district much since. A lot of stores there started closing, and... Ooh. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> you can't blame it all on Juness, can you? Yes, we can. <sighs> Why not? Hey, it's Saki-senpai. Sorry, be Saki. right back. What is Saki doing here? Who's that? Is she Jessica's girlfriend? <laughs> he wishes. <laughs> okay, wait. I think I can kind of read that sign. It says, uh, "Is that chi chibi ko?" Okay, I can read that second part. That's Saki Kanishi. Her I can read that. Runs a liquor store in the shopping district. <laughs> Just case in a war zone, that friend zone. The, the Kohai zone. <laughs> the pro zone. <laughs> Wait, the pro zone? Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I got it. I got it. Yeah, because she sees him as her little brother, right? I okay, that's certainly worse. Time, hey, how's it going? You look beat. Hey, I'm finally on break. What's up, Hanachan? Hanachan? Boosting the family business by bringing your friends here? Oh, madam, you madam? found me. What is with this race? This is awful. She didn't even say anything bad. Kidding aside, you look down. Did something happen? Oh, it's nothing. I'm just a little tired. Hey, if you need to talk, I'm always willing to listen. Oh. I... <laughs> the simp. <laughs> I'm okay. Thanks, though. Oh, the rejection. <sighs> Why did I leave school early yesterday? Hey, is he the kid who transferred here? Well, am I famous or anything? Well, okay. I got her attention. I'm going to steal her. Are you the transfer student? Oh, did you hear about me already? Well, Yosuke is the son of the president of Yunez, so everyone probably thinks any who bring to Yunez is only to only for to become them a new client. Oh, well, yeah, fair. But I mean, I will do that too. <laughs> Not gonna lie. That means more money for me too. <laughs> well, did you hear about me already? She's totally flirting with me. It must be nice to have someone else from the big city to talk to, huh? I don't see Hanachan hanging out with the other guys much. Not necessarily. You shut up. He doesn't have too many friends. Ignore. So I hope you two get along good. Hanachan's a good guy, but he can get nosy sometimes. You gotta tell him right to his face when he starts to annoy you. Oh, okay, that's a bad sign, Hanachan. <laughs> yeah, he's annoying. <laughs> oh, there is. I'm raising her better than you, Josuke. All right, break it up. You're kind of getting on my nerves. <laughs> Poor Hanachan. Well, my break's just about over. Back to work I go. Laters. Later. Oh, what, See senpai? you. <laughs> Don't steal bro's crush. It may be too late. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Saki senpai says I'm annoying, but she's even nosier than me. Oh, delusion. She has a younger brother, and she treats me pretty much the same way. 
Does he really think he has a chance? Oh, you don't want her treating you like a brother, huh? <laughs> the bros. <laughs> yes. So that's how it is. He has no chance whatsoever. The daughter of a local family-run liquor store and the scion of the invading chain. Oh, the flame of forbidden love. This is just like Romeo and Juliet. Dude, it's not like that. Oh, really? Oh, really? <laughs> well, I know just the thing to cheer up that lovesick heart. I mean, come on, it was the logical thing to say. You ever hear of the Midnight Channel? Hmm? You're supposed to look into a TV that switched off, alone, exactly at midnight on a rainy night. While you're staring at your own image, another person will appear on the screen. Yeah, that's the reflection. And they say that person's your soulmate. I am my own soulmate. What? For a second I thought you were actually going to say something useful. How can you get all excited over such a childish urban legend like that? Childish, huh? You don't believe it, do you? Of course I don't. Well, it's raining tonight. Let's all try it out. Then you'll see. Try it out? Wait, you haven't even tried it yourself? Bruh. Wow. I'm trying to remember the last time I heard something this stupid. Um, I can think of a couple of things you say that was, uh... Even stupid there from this scene alone, you know? Like Kakurembo or La Ouija. Baby Blue game. Okay, I only know the Ouija, honestly. I I don't know what Kakurembo is. Nor the Baby Blue game. I know the the Bloody Mary one. And I know the one from Corpse Party, because I played that one. <laughs> Maybe that is Kakurembo. Who knows? All that aside, you know that incident yesterday? You guys think it was murder? Yes. Ooh, what if the culprit behind it was still lurking around? Maybe it was you, Yosuke. <laughs> Jeez. You shouldn't joke about stuff like that. Now who's the childish one? Hattori Kakurembo, the hide and seek lonely game. What is it about? I've never heard about it, I think. A Japanese ritual to play hide and seek with a plushie and knife? What? What All is I'm that? Saying is, you guys better try it out tonight. It looks it, it sounds really cool, so please explain. You heard a rumor about the, mi the Midnight Channel, where one can see one's soulmate on a rainy night. Maybe you should try it out tonight. I feel forced to try it. Oh. Another dinner along with Nanako. Did your father call? No. He always says he will. Hi, home. <laughs> <sighs> what a day. I'm back. Hi, Mike. Did anything happen while I was out? No. You're late again. Hi, late again. I'm sorry. I'm busy Hi, sorry. <laughs> okay, what is stop now? Can you put the news on for me? Ah. Next, more details in the developing story on the incident in Foggy Inaba. In Foggy Inaba? Announcer Mayumi Yamano's dead body was found hanging above a house in this isolated rural town. It is confirmed that Miss Yamano had been involved in an affair with Taro Namatame, husband of Enka singer Misuzu Hiragi. Uh, at this point, I think we all know about this story already, so could you please like sum it up a little bit it's a follow-up report about the incident yesterday it is an invocation ritual you choose a stuffed animal with arms you open it with the knife and remove the stuffing you fill it with rice and your nails depending on the version you must also put your blood your blood wait what 
What? And what does it do? Uh, what Miss Yamano, the TV announcer, was alive. She was having an affair with a councilman's secretary. Yeah, I know. The man's wife seems to be Misuzu Hiragi. Wait, 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 wait. How can I? The police plan okay. to investigate this relationship. No. And question any personnel involved. In addition, no. We now bring you an exclusive How interview I... with the local student who oh, found here. Miss Yamano's body. Hiragi. Hiragi. Okay, I wasn't sure if Hiragi had two eyes or just one. Uh, an interview with a kid. <sighs> Where the hell did they find her? You seal the doll with red thread and tie the stuffed animal. You fill a bowl with salt and water. You give it a name and hitting it three times with a knife. You say, one, two, three, I found you. And you go out to hide. Eh? That sounds sick though. <laughs> that sounds so cool. What went through your mind when you saw it? Could you tell she was dead? Did you see her face? Oh, isn't that just kiss girlfriend? Uh, um. You feel like you've seen her before somewhere. Don't you think it's scary that someone was killed on a foggy day? Why? <laughs> huh? She was killed? Oh, uh, so did you see anyone suspicious around here? No, not really. Well, you're being really useful. We heard that you found it when you left school early. Did you have some personal business to take care of? Huh? That's... You're not doing anything. The reporter's enthusiasm seems to be perplexing the girl. Looking closely, she reminds you of Saki Konishi, Yosuke's senpai. A tragedy that occurred near the local shopping district. A time you repeat the name you gave him three times and turn off all the lights, you can only have candles as light. To finish the game, you must fill your mouth with the same salt from the bowl and repeat, I win three times if you, uh, the doll has not hurt you. Supposedly, the doll comes to life with the soul you invoked and will try to find you to hurt you. Huh? That sounds cool though. Maybe I should try. <laughs> and after... And after that, you're, you are safe? Really? Good luck. Many <laughs> store owners are raising concerns like about imagine. losing oh. customers as oh, a result. Oh jeez, I lost, so I will uh, stop possessing this doll or something. <laughs> if they lose more customers, it'll be because you're making such a stink about it. It really is a bizarre case, isn't it? I mean, hanging someone upside down from an antenna. <laughs> I'd have to say it's a warning or a sign from the culprit. Yes, but so far... No one has come forward to take credit for the crime. <sighs> yeah, imagine. Calls, yeah, it's though. been me. So the cause of death is still unknown, and they don't have a single suspect yet? Taxpayers' funds are going to a police force who can't even figure out if this is an accident or a homicide? How can anyone think this is an accident, bro? Come on. Oh, he sleepy. EP. <laughs> After that, you're safe, the classic myth that the salt is for... Oh, yeah, okay, true. True, true, true. We'll be right back after these messages. Fair point. Oh. Shut up, everyone, shut up. At Juness, wait, wait, every wait. day is customer appreciation day. Come see for yourself. Uh... Yep. Every day is great at your Juness. Every day is great at your Juness. Okay. <laughs> hey, Dad, can we go to Juness together sometime? Can we go to the shopping mall one day? No. No. <laughs> ah, poor thing. Jeez. And I've already been there. The other game I said earlier, Baby Blue is only possible if you have a bathroom that can produce mist from the heat. Okay, I have one. I do. The vapor, you mean? Yeah. 
can't hear raining outside. It's almost midnight. Your soul made appear as if you look into a TV on a rainy night. Could Jesus' story be true? Well, What just happened? <laughs> what is that? Are you okay? No. Uh, you must stand in front of the mirror and with all the lights in the house off, act as if you were holding and lulling a baby while repeating baby blue 13 times. If you do it correctly, you will feel like a baby is in your arms and in the fog mirror will reflect a blue baby that is trying to make you fall. To finish the game, you only have to letting him fall, killing the baby, and doing it before in the mirror appears a woman that is supposed to be his mother. Okay, that sounds cool. <laughs> I I probably won't do it though. Kind of. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye. Nanako seems to have returned to her room. Okay, thank you for the help. If you don't do that, it's said that you will see a baby silhouette running in your house. Baby's crying and feeling like someone trying to choke you while you sleep. And what if you do? Won't your mother, uh, not, not your mother, uh, the mother hound you? You decide to talk about it with the others tomorrow. Uh, perfect timing, sorry, move over. She forced herself under your umbrella. Wow. <laughs> I did have my own, but I saw this kung fu movie where they use an umbrella to pull off some sweet moves. And I accidentally broke mine trying to mimic the movie. Bruh. By the way, did you see it? I did. I had to tell, but the person it showed. Never mind, I'll save it for when the others are around. We're gonna be late for school. Uh, the only option is moving to other house or trying to live with your new baby. Yeah, that's wholesome. Uh, um... There are people that can't have babies. They could just do that. <laughs> it's it, it's kind of awkward to only bring this up now, but we're pretty close here. Uh, um, I'm gonna just go ahead and run the rest of the way. Uh, don't worry about it. Huh? Are you sure? Thanks. You say so then. I guess it's okay. Thanks. The rest. Come on. I mean, she has been racing me too. In all honesty. Oh, that's the that one song from the meme. 
Hello everyone, my name is Kimiko Sofue, and I don't know how much you know about poor history, but I'm an expert. First, a little about me. I love to use my dozer to look for lost items, and there's nothing quite like a romance. In fact, world history is a magnificent romance. History is like a river. It was born in the past and flows deeper for work. I hope we could all enjoy the profundity of history together. <laughs> and since this is my first lecture, I'll start with an easy question. Our transferee, Mr. Susumu, please stand up. That's me. The Western calendar is based on Anno Domini, the traditionally believed year of Jesus Christ's birth. What is the year before 1 AD called? Uh, that's 1 BC, right? You gave the answer you think is correct. And uh, you seem to understand this well. I'm just a kid. You think that history is like math? Uh, 0 AD will be the natural assumption, but world history is much more complicated. The Gregorian calendar we use today is based on the Julian calendar, which was made while there was no concept of the zero as a number. That's why when counting backwards we go from 1 AD straight to 1 BC. Hopefully that was a nice introduction to world history. You get the current answer. Your knowledge has increased. <laughs> Is there any normal teacher in Persona Saga? Well, let's try finding one. the body being hung upside down? It's so freaky. Freaky? Is it supposed to be like mimicking an execution? It's messed up. My senpai told me it was a third year named Saki who found the body. Oh, really? Y yo. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, hey. It's a. Uh, it's not really that important, but. Well, yesterday on TV, I, uh. Oh, uh, you never mind. Look, I'll tell you later. <laughs> <laughs> the delusion. Yosuke, did you hear the rumor? Saki Senpai's supposedly the one who discovered that body. I wonder if that's why she looked so down. She doesn't seem to be at school today either. Huh? Hey, Yukiko, are you helping out at the inn today too? Things are really out of hand right now. I'm sorry. Why though? Are people coming because of the accident? Is it I know there are a lot of people that, seem way that stressed out today. is into that. I guess they're running her ragged. By the way, did you see it, it? last night? Did you see it? What is it? <laughs> part one or part two? <laughs> huh? Uh, well, what about you? Why don't you want to say? I did! I seriously saw a girl! Oh. But my soulmate's a girl? What's that supposed to mean? That means you're a lesbian. I couldn't quite tell who There's it was. There's nothing wrong with that. But it was a girl for sure. Her hair was brown, about shoulder length. She was wearing our school uniform and... Hey, I think that's the same person I saw. I couldn't make out that much detail, though. The image I saw was much blurrier. Wait, so you saw it too? And we saw the same girl? D does that mean <laughs> we have the same soulmate? You will have to fight for her. How should I know? How about you? Did you see it? You told them about what happened last night. It sounds like we all saw the same person. But weird voices aside... What was that about getting sucked into your TV? <laughs> Maybe that was my fantasy. Were you that tired last night? You must have just fallen asleep in front of your TV. That'd be one interesting dream, though. I like the part where you got stuck because your TV was too small. <laughs> That's pretty realistic. Are you calling me fat? If it had been bigger... That's what she said. No, 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 no. Oh, that reminds me. Our family's been talking about buying a bigger TV. Epic. Oh, yeah? Who, who asked? Well, flat screen TVs are definitely in these days. Want to go check them out on the way back? We're beefing up our electronics department this month. Oh, definitely. 
My parents don't know anything about electronics, and I've just got to see my kung fu movies on the big screen. What a nerd. What, the <laughs> <laughs> what a nerd. We've got some pretty big ones in stock. I bet they'd be big enough for you to fit into. <laughs> <laughs> you got it right back at you. They don't believe you at all. You decided to go to Junez with the others. Okay. Junez Electronics Department. Wow! This is huge! And holy crap, it's expensive. Who buys something like this? Yukiko, for example. I don't know. Rich folks? Yukiko, for example. Honestly, not many people shop for TVs here. That's why we don't have clerks around. Huh. Not worth trying then, I guess. Well, at least looking's free. Uh, that portrait. <laughs> nope. Can't get in. Figures. <laughs> this proves it. It was all just a dream. Besides, these flat screen TVs are so thin, you just end up on the other side. Yeah. Ah, what am I saying? <laughs> so, Chie, what kind of TV are you guys in the market for? They said they wanted one that's cheap. You got any suggestions? Well, that's cheap. You will get a small one. <clears throat> well, miss, uh, might I suggest this one over here? It's the Bro, really want the race. just released this spring. <laughs> I should have asked what you meant by cheap right off the bat. Well, yes. You got connections, right? Okay, Come wait, hold on. on. Hook me up. Hold on. Uh, I'm going to uh, enable my cursor again. Wait, not here. Okay. So, see those. Those are the ones that you should buy. Maybe those are good enough. <laughs> okay. You know I can't do that. Hey, how about this one over here? It's a display unit. It's a little old, but... If a TV this big, you really might be able to go inside. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> hey, could oh, yeah. you look? What kind of TV do you? Huh? Something wrong, Yosuke? I'm being sucked in. Isn't that wrong? <laughs> Is his arm in the TV? Kind of, yes. Whoa. Uh, is that some kind of new model? L like with a, a new function? Yeah, you just can uh, get your arm inside the TV and touch whatever is on the screen at the moment. Yeah. Isn't that awesome? Like, if you watch um, an animal documentary, you just can pet a buffalo. That's Hell pretty no. cool. You I don't know why a buffalo specifically, but really a buffalo. Did you really stick your hand through the screen? Oh man, this is for real. That's some magic trick, man. So how's it work, huh? What's the magician's secret? Both of them are staring at you astonished. You may be able to put in more than just your arm. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? <laughs> Dad, don't do that! What are you doing? Oh my god! <laughs> what can you see? There's empty space inside. You tell them that. What do you mean inside? Well, inside the TV. Don't you see that I am inside, literally? What, what do you mean, empty space? Well, a space that is empty. This is very spacious in here. Spacious. Are you guys dumb or anything? 
I mean, what's going on? For fuck's sake, guys. Old crap. I think this is all too much for my bladder. What the? Are you gonna pee your pants? I mean, I will too. I've been holding it in all day. I haven't had a chance to go. I can't hold it anymore. Just go to the bathroom. Yeah. Natural. Shit, customers, they're coming. Bruh. What? But we've got a guy half stuck in the TV here. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, what are we gonna do? But you can't say that. Uh... Okay, that's a tough situation. What do you say <laughs> in, in a situation like this? Uh, you see, uh, the TV just comes with a teen guy. Okay, you can just keep him. You can pet him if you want. Maybe you can make him do the chores. I don't know. Why are you running like that? Wait, <laughs> That's his serve. Come on. Wom. <laughs> Okay, that must have hard. Ow! I landed right on my wallet. Oh. Man, where the heck are we? What is this place? Some place inside Juness? Hell no, it isn't. I mean, we fell through a TV. Actually, uh, what is going on here? <laughs> I just don't care uh... about anything. Okay, if you excuse me a second, I'm so, going to go get something uh, to eat. We're still alive, right? Okay. Whoop.
All right, I'm back. Sorry for the delay. There we go. <laughs> okay. So sorry for the weird noises that I will make. I I just brought the the food actually. I just brought some donuts and some milkshake, so I'm going to make weird noises. <laughs> I'm really sorry. Um, we're still alive. Is this a dream? No, I'd say the pain I'm feeling right now is very real. R real? I don't know what you will consider a too rare noise. <laughs> very, 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 very rare. I don't know. What Whoa. do you expect to hear now? What now? Did you wet your pants? No, oh, stupid. Look around. Is this... A studio? All this fog. Or there's no place like this in Inaba, is there? Hell no. But man, this it, place is huge. No, for the eating part. Yummy. What are we gonna do? Huh? Let's look around, but, yes. But... Not bugs. Look, we need to get home and... Not my problem. Huh? Wait a minute. Wait, which way did we come in from? We came from upside. Uh, I don't see a way in or out. What? That can't be right. How could that be? I don't know. Don't ask me. We just pop up here. I can't take this anymore. I want to go home. Okay, so how? Popping off. We are doomed. <laughs> what? Don't say stuff like that. We are doomed. Let's calm down and think about this. All right. So we need to find a way out. Is there really a way out of here? We got in, so we must be able to get out somehow. That's good reasoning. That's true, but... If there's no exit, we're trapped, so let's cross our fingers and look around. Hmm. That Why door... Is this place? Seems feels different very from nice. Where we were before. Not dangerous at all. It just brings you to Persona 5. It looks like we're in some kind of building, but... Damn, this fog's so thick I can hardly see. Do you know what is thick? I'm going to tell you what is thick. My ass. Are you sure we're not wandering farther away? I can't be positive, but we gotta trust our instinct a little. <laughs> well, what do I do if my ass is thick? I know, but... It seems that there's no choice for now but to continue onward to the Persona 5 door. Yes, let's go. Hey, is it me or is the fog lighter here? I mean, it's a house. No service. What a surprise. 
Can you guys slow down a little? It's hard enough to see where you're going. Huh? What the? What? Oh. It's a dead end. There's no exit. Okay. A nice, a nice place to stay at, yeah. It keeps getting creepier and creepier the further we go. Look, there's even a mistletoe hanging from the floor. Is it Christmas? Wow. <laughs> uh, I can't hold it any longer. My bladder's gonna explode. Just pay, bro. I'm not gonna do what I'm not gonna do. I gotta let it out before I piss my pants. You're going here? Oh, you have gotta be kidding. Turn around. I can't go if everyone's watching. And why don't you get outside? Uh, I can't do it. It's all your fault if my bladder bursts. Yeah, of course. Like I care. Anyways, what's with this room? I don't see anything wrong with it. Do you? I hear Tom. Oh. Okay, I'm done eating. No more noises. Probably. Their faces are all cut out. A cold day in a house without Koopa. <laughs> I mean, this place in the state it is it looks way better than many houses uh, with Okupa, so in the state. Really hate this person. I've seen some shows, some TV shows that are like, wow. But look at the state of this place. Dude, this chair and rope, that kind of arrangement is never good. What do you mean, rope? That's a mistletoe. It's tied in a noose. No. Is this a scarf? It's a mistletoe. Let's go back to where we came from and look somewhere else for an exit. Hey, I think I've seen that poster before. Who cares? Let's go! <laughs> I'm sick of this place. And I'm not feeling so good. Now that you mention it, me too. We cuss. Could it be due to these places? Okay, sorry, hiccup. Um, this place is oppressive atmosphere. All right, let's go back. I'm seriously starting to feel sick. Sick in the head. We knew that already, Josuke. Phew! We finally made it back here. Wait, what's that? There's something over there. Hmm? No. Okay, hold on. I had to change my face. No. He doesn't look menacing at all. <laughs> what is this thing? A monkey? A bear? What in the world? That's what I want to know. Who are you guys? How could you even think he looks like a monkey? It talked! What are you? You wanna fight? D don't yell at me like that. <laughs> Poor thing. Maybe it will be better to ask him nicely. Uh, there's no funny option. What are you? 
I'm a bear. Can't you tell? I live here by myself. That's very impressive. <laughs> I've always lived here. It doesn't have a name. What do you mean it doesn't have a name? You live here? If I was you guys, I'd hurry back to the other side. Someone's been throwing people in here. It's a big headache. Huh? Throwing people in? What are you talking about? I don't know who's doing it. I just want them to think before they go doing things like that. Hey, what's your problem? What gives you the right to yell at us like that? What are you? Where are we? What the heck is going on here? Will you chill? Come on, look at him like poor little thing. Yeah. God. <laughs> I am his protector. I told you. Anyways, you should hurry back. What it comes down to is, you want us to get out of here, right? Well, so do we. We just don't know how, damn it. Uh, that's why I'm saying I'll let you out. Like I keep saying, we don't know where the frickin' exit. Wait, what? You don't even let him talk. What? what TV. The hell? Oh, but I can go through those ones, huh? Where did those TVs come from? Okay, now go, go, get out of here. I'm a busy bear. What's going on now? Whoa! Hey, what are you doing? I think he touched her butt. Stop pushing! And his butt too. And probably mine as well. Wait, you were to Galicia? Why did you say that? <laughs> did I say something in Galician? Is this? Oh! <laughs> Fog destroyed house, a rare yellow atmosphere. Yeah, that's very Galicia. <laughs> Wait, weren't you from Bolivia? You seem to know a lot about the Spanish geography. Did we make it back? <laughs> Attention shoppers! Our daily limited time sale will now begin at the side oh, dish geez. area on the first floor. Why not try the delicious fresh produce Juness picked for you this morning as your side dish for dinner tonight? Because I don't want to. All ages are invited to take advantage of this incredible bargain. Wow. Crap. Well, that's a way to phrase it. <sighs> Looks like we were in there for quite a while. That's right. Now I remember where I saw that poster before. Look over there. That's the poster we saw. What's up now? What poster? Oh. Hey, you're right. They're the same. I couldn't tell before without the face, but it was Misuzu Hiragi. She's been all over the news lately. Something about her husband having an affair with that announcer lady who died the other day. Okay, well... Hey, so does that mean... That weird room we saw... I had a Spanish friend. He always lady? said all the bad things about Spain, so I knew a few things and places there. <laughs> okay, fair. Yeah, you must know the the important things, huh? Now that I think about it, there was that creepy noose hanging from the ceiling. What else do you know? I'm curious. Yeah, stop. No more. We gotta stop talking about this. I'm gonna wipe what happened today from my brain. I don't think my poor heart can take anymore. I bet you still got. I'm pee. feeling a chill too. Let's go home. I want to lie down and rest. Hey. Hello. Welcome home. Mmm. Mmm. Una pregunta. Tortilla de patata con o sin cebolla. 
Well, it depends. Honestly. Well, lo, voy a decirlo en español. Porque esto es una pregunta española. De, de habla hispana. Los gringos no lo van a entender. <risa> um, si no está muy hecha, con cebolla. Si está muy hecha, prefiero que sea sin cebolla. Porque no me gusta el sabor de la cebolla frita. O, o, o tostada o, o quemada, básicamente. <risa> hmm. So, I'm a little bit of both teams. Hmm. La prefiero poco hecha, por cierto. <laughs> It's better that you two never meet. <laughs> oh no, I'm gonna get assaulted. <laughs> He hates with onions. Well, uh, personally, I love onions, okay? I'm kind of like Shrek. Um, well, I doubt you'd know. But have you heard anything about a student named Saki Konishi? I don't know her. Uh, she discovered the body. People feel sorry for her. She wasn't at school today. She wasn't at school today. Oh, I see. He don't like onions too, but he hates absolutely with onions. Oh, damn. Well, yeah, we... He's he's gonna he's gonna jump me. He's gonna jump. He's gonna jump me. He's gonna throw me through the window or something like that. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> well, we will be honest, become enemies. We got a call from her family. She's disappeared. Oh no. We've got people looking for her, but she hasn't been found yet. Oh no. <sighs> Work just keeps piling up. And now, more on the case still casting a shadow over the foggy town of shadow. Inaba. Not long ago, television announcer Mayumi Yamano was found dead in the small town. Up until now, her whereabouts prior to her death had been unknown. Only if he cool, but it's a bit weak physically. Oh, that's my chance. He's the one getting jumped. <laughs> He's going to be the one thrown through the window. But the police investigation <laughs> has found that she had been staying in the region's famous Amagi Inn. Oh, no. She had apparently been staying there alone. Perhaps she was taking a vacation to recover from her ordeal. Oh, yes, the Amagi Inn. Their hot springs are first Yeah, rate. that's what matters. The manager's teenage daughter also works there. And, and why did you that bring that up? Why are you talking about Yukiko? What, like, what does she have to do with anything? Or maybe what will fall trying to throw the other through the window? Well, that's a win-win. <laughs> If that happens, she'll be one of the youngest managers on record. I should book another trip there. Uh, I see. Moving along, it's time for the weather report. <laughs> okay, I don't care. Weather report. The rain has begun to subside. Oh. From now until morning, heavy fog warnings will be in effect in the Inaba region. Visibility will be severely reduced, so please be careful if you plan on driving in the area. The news continues. Yes, before the announcer was found dead, she was apparently staying at the Amagin run by Yukiko's family. And it seems the whereabouts of Saki Konishi, who discovered the body, the, 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 the body, are unknown. Is the ramen ready now? Give it some more time. Wow. <laughs> Please you. Please. Bless you. You sneeze. You felt as a light chill. Are you sick? You're In the head, still yes. still adjusting to the new environment. I guess. Nanako, could you get him some cold medicine? Why cold? I want it hot. <laughs> you should get to bed after you take it. Um, okay. Can I? Where's my medicine? Hey. Hey, Dad. 
Oh, is the bot not working? I I I was thinking uh it's not working. I was thinking that the bot was pretty it, he's my dad now. <laughs> he's my dad. I was thinking the bot was pretty quiet today. I have to fix it, I guess. Okay, um let me send it then. Uh mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, wait. I'll I'll try to have it fixed after the stream. It happens sometimes. There is it. Hmm. My bad, I'm sorry. Okay. So, uh, they still don't let me do anything. Oh, cutscene. Oh, jeez. Okay, another one. They are oh, fully like flies. I'm off. Dojima left the house. Dad has to go do something. He got a call, so he left. Hmm. It's funny, the rank is target and my PFP is as, as an assassin from an anime. Oh, really? Wait, who is that? Wait, isn't, isn't, maybe I'm wrong, I'm sorry, but he looks like that one person from, uh, oh, never mind. <laughs> Can I could see it? Cause, okay, I kind of, um, kind of know the anime, I think, but I've never watched it. I was going to say that he looks like the guy from Hunter x Hunter. <laughs> how, how is he called? Kurapika, I don't know. I'm sorry. By the way, Target is uh, the name of my fan base. Leorio. I don't know. I actually haven't watched Hunter x Hunter either. <laughs> I don't know. It's a very good anime. I'll look it up. I wanna. I wanna watch more animes. I watched Freedom recently. Kurapika is a blonde kid. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Then I, I got that. I got that mix. Police yeah. cars zooming by. You live by the police station, don't you? Did you hear anything? I heard some yelling, but nothing more. A total totally disappointment. disappointment. Jeez, you need to pay more attention to stuff like that. How else are we supposed to get the juicy stories? You hear sirens nearby. It seems there has been an incident. You decide to head to school. I'm not going to have a school either, so... Hey, did you see it yesterday? Of course not. What is that rumor for real? I don't know, but it seems like a lot of people have seen it. You were here, people gossiping about something. Hmm. Yukiko said she'd be here after lunch. I wonder why they're holding a school assembly all of a sudden. Hey, what's wrong, Yosuke? Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. Everyone, please settle down. Why is bro dressed like that? <laughs> a friend dropped this game while we played it in Discord because the prologue was very long for him. First, well, I mean, it is very long, but... That's normal in this kind of games, I think. Not not only Persona, just J, JRPGs are pretty pretty prone to have long prologues, right? For example, Xenoblade is pretty long too. I don't know what will be his reaction when he knows the prologue of Persona 5. Is it long? 
Technically, the prologue of Persona 5 is all the flashback. I did. I never knew it was long. I regret to say that I have a terrible announcement for all of you. Like I've I've heard that it's long, but I don't really know how long. One of our third-year students, Ms. Saki Konishi of Class Three, has passed away. Oh shit! Oh passed shit! Passed away. Passed away, as in. Well, the real prologue is all the first dungeon. You mean Persona 5? Ms. Konishi was found deceased early this morning. But the tutorials and tips finish after almost half game. Holy shit. You mean Persona 5? Like, half the game, the really? The reasons behind her passing <laughs> are currently under investigation by the police. If they ask you for your cooperation, I urge you as students of this school to provide only the facts. Here? Oh, Alright, please quiet down. No. I have been assured by the faculty that there's been no evidence that bullying was involved in the incident. Okay, then I'm pretty more calm now. So mind what you say, not only to the police, but to anyone who asks. <laughs> please don't make us look bad. Found dead? How could this happen? Well, because she died. Half game is a flashback. It's not a spoiler because it's the first thing that you see when you play it. Oh, interesting. <laughs> okay, that's that's funny. I I wonder if I'll ever play Persona Five. It, it will be really cool to stream it. Announcer, right? It's so but I don't know if I can. Well, last time it was from an antenna, but this time she was hanging from a telephone pole. It's got to be a serial murder case. Someone said the cause of death was some unknown poison. Unknown? Come on, this isn't some sci-fi drama. Oh, by the way, did sci -fi you hear? drama. Someone saw a girl that looked like Saki on that midnight channel thingy. They oh. said she totally looked like she was in pain. Isn't that scary? <laughs> Sounds like someone had a nightmare. The media's been broadcasting their interviews with her non-stop. It's a cool so game, but also it's very long. Ah, but that's brain. no problem. The longer, the more fun, right? <laughs> there is a term with uh, short games too, but... Even short games usually hey, take me a couple did you guys of check streams. Out the, TV last night? the only exception I think has been a short hike, which I finish in two hours. Yosuke, not you too. Just like Persona 3 sec. plus Persona 4, Something time to beat me. makes. So Wait, really? I watched it again. Is it that long? I had no idea. I think the girl on the screen. Technically, the more long game I played, only surpassed by this guy of five. Oh, is this guy of five also long? Is there a thing with uh, the fifth games in the series? Hmm. There's no mistaking it. Now I want a Super Mario Galaxy 5. Senpai looked like she was writhing in pain. And then she disappeared from the screen. What? You heard Senpai's body was found in a similar situation as that announcer's, right? What? 120 hours? Are you kidding me? That's well, too long. You told us about how he was all excited that his soulmate was the announcer. <laughs> Maybe. Just maybe. But... Yep, holy shit. I'm not joking, holy shit. <laughs> and then it will take me a full year to finish because I also take longer than usual Ms. when Yamano I stream. Might have been on that midnight channel before she died if I too. were to stream Persona 5, either I make a uh, 7 hour streams or it will take too long. What's that supposed to mean? Hold on. Are you saying. People who appear on that TV <gasps> die? I can't say for sure. Oh, well, he's into something here. But something tells me. I just can't dismiss it as coincidence. <gasps> Plus, remember what that bear thing said? 
how that place was dangerous and we should leave Skaya 5 is a Japanese grind game, the main history is 40 hours and with the 100% 180, what do you have to do to, to 100% it? It's a long, uh, it's, a, it's, it's a very big difference of time. It also said that someone's been throwing people in there. And that room with the posters on the wall, it has to have something to do with the announcer's death. I mean, don't you think there's some kind of connection there? Couldn't that world in the TV have something to do with Senpai and the announcer's death? Well, what do you think? I've been streaming for two hours and a half. And I st we still didn't get in the first dungeon. <laughs> so it's not just me, huh? I'm playing it to get funny. I'm not searching the 100%, but I'm playing it casually. As a typical anime, humor gags and goofy characters. Oh, I like that. I like that. I, I may have to look if into. There it. is a connection. Hmm. It's a good bet that the two of them went inside that world. I don't usually game to 100%, at least not on stream. But for example, I 100%. Uh, uh, I like. I didn't 100% Hollow Knight because I couldn't finish the last two pantheons in the post game. But that's about it. I did everything else. Which means, if we look around, we might find a place that has something well, to do with the Well, not the last two. The last one. Uh, there was only one pantheon left. Hmm. Yosuke, don't tell me. Yeah, I'm thinking about going in again. I want to find out for myself. I usually just 100% the games that I really Don't like. Do this. That like really, 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 really listen. like. And if it's not a hassle, if if it takes too long and it takes too many steps, uh, you may say, yeah, no. You think we can rely on the police? They haven't made any progress on the announcer's case. Besides, even if we told them about the world inside the TV, there's no way they're going to believe us. Yeah, that's true. If I'm completely off base, oh hey, Annie, that's fine. <laughs> you're back. Hello, <laughs> I like the bad ending of Persona 4. Oh, there is a bad ending, no spoilers. It's just, I need to know why Senpai had to die like this. Yosuke, after what I've seen and what I've put together, there's no way I, I was can never going. Oh, okay, I thought you were going. <laughs> Yeah, it's true that you said that you were playing something, right? <laughs> Sorry. What are you You're playing, the by the way? Person who can if help I me. may ask. I'm gonna go get ready. I'll be waiting for you at Juness. Okay, bye. Josuke has asked you to take a to take him into the TV world again. I can kind of understand how he feels. But we can't be sure we'll be able to get out safely again. What should we do? <laughs> so it's about... Do you guys know the usual endings of... It's about the friends we've met along the way. Well, in the bad ending, it's not about the friends. It's about the enemies we've made along the way. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> uh, okay, actually, that will, that will be kind of cool, actually. I have to think about something like that. Uh, yeah, go well, with Josuke. You serious? I did. I did hey, never care about my friends. Imagine. We can't leave Yosuke alone. Would you like to save your progress thus far? Yes. Okay. Afternoon? And why not before noon? You guys came. Yeah, that's what she said. We came to stop you, idiot. That's also what she said. Come on, you really shouldn't do this. It's too dangerous. Did you use each of one saves? You never know. <laughs> you never know when you may need one of the old saves. I know. Usually I don't. Back once, right? But it's mostly in games I know there's... Uh, like for example, when I play Kingdom Hearts, 
there are like 99 save files, right? I usually just use one. Because, what? Oh. Uh, I didn't do something, but you can just go back. Like, you can just return to that world, you know? that Like, there's no punishment. If we go in from the same location, maybe we'll meet that bear again. Are you doing that in this guy apply for the portrait enough. of saves? Oh, is that a thing? Just like in Kingdom Hearts. I can't just act like everyone else and pretend this has nothing to do with me. That's true, but... What about you? Could you just walk away? I can leave it alone. This... I'm worried about Chie. There's no telling what may happen over there. You voice your concern over Chie coming along. Your understanding has increased. Oh! <laughs> you can change it manually. Yeah. So each I finish a chapter of the story, I change to the next character. Oh! Okay, that's not like Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not going in without a plan. Chie, I'm leaving you in charge of this. Huh? What's that? A rope? Looks like a good plan. We'll go in with this tied to me. So I want you to hold on to this and wait here. Wh what? Then this is a lifeline? Come on, wait a sec. Here, this is for you. No. Oh, how considerate of you. Golf club. On medicine. Why? I thought it might be better than going in empty handed. All right, let's go. There's no use wasting any more time. Chie, whatever you do, don't let go of the rope. Let go of the rope. That will wait! be funny, I think. I said wait! <laughs> um, and something I like about this guy of high is the humor. It has very funny interactions between the cast. The bad about that game is the theme of language. Only single English and French. So, so many people doesn't give a chance for the language. You will get a surprise out the rope. Oh! <laughs> See? I, knew I did, I did, work. okay. Just as I say that. Uh, yeah, I understand about the language. I remember when uh, Kingdom Hearts for the 3DS uh, dropped. Uh, it wasn't translated here in Spain. It was only in English. And... We were so pissed about it. I remember clearly. Dream drop distance, exactly. Mm. Now what? I don't know if they ended up um, translating it in the compilation. I have to. I have to stream Kingdom Hearts one day. I love Kingdom Hearts so much. Is this? Look, this is the same place as last time. So they are connected from place to place. You guys, why'd you come back? <laughs> Hello. I get it. You're the ones behind this. Exactly. You're that thing from last time. I like to a lot of ritual games, especially the RPG ones. Oh yeah, same. Same. Wait, what the hell did you hmm. just say? I honestly love all games, and I plan to stream some of them. Maybe Chrono Trigger could be nice to stream one day. But I have to admit that I am usually really bad at the most classic RPG games. I'm so bad at them. Lately, I, can I tell tried uh, one of the earliest uh, Final Fantasy games, and I got clipped. Definitely Chrono Trigger must be one. Yeah, it's one of the best ones, right? It's That's what I heard. I've never played it. Messed up. This is the second time you guys came here, and I don't think anyone forced you in. Like, what do you know? That means you're the most suspicious. You guys must be the ones throwing the people in here. That's so cringe, man. Shut up. Shut up. What are you talking about throwing people in? If someone was thrown in here and they couldn't get out, they might die. Well, duh, that's the, that's the plan. Just okay. 
Who would do such a... A killer? Wait a sec. <laughs> you dumb. All this talk about someone throwing people in here. Does he mean Senpai and the announcer? Did that someone throw those two in here? Hey, what do you think? Well, right now I'm thinking that I'm hungry. But there's no funny option, so that must be it. Yeah, I agree. Let's assume he's telling the truth. Could it be that someone's throwing people in here intending to kill them? If that's the case. What are you guys mumbling about? Why'd you come here anyways? Why do you care? It's a one-way door. You can't get out once you're in. Oh, but you're here, so you can let us out again. Remember how I had to let you guys yes, out? Yes, but you're here again. Yeah, whatever. We don't need your help this time. See, this time we have a life. Li Does he know? <laughs> Does he know? What? Hey, you better let us out once we're done investigating here. <laughs> Uh, the traduction for this game was in only four months. Wait, really? <laughs> but there is a lot of text, isn't there? Only four months? That's amazing. I've lived here for a long time, but it's never been noisy like this till now. They must have really liked the game. Do you have proof? Prove to me you're not throwing people in here. How can I prove that to you? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> See? So it is, you guys! And Teddy has a lot of his dialogues changed, making a few changes in his personality. Oh, really? I didn't know about that. For the last time, it's not us. So we've got nothing to prove to you. So how is he in the in the Japanese version? Originally, some things that he is gonna do are with a bit innocence. Not the way that he ended. Hey, oh. you better answer our questions. This isn't like last time when That's we came That's interesting, by actually. We're dead serious. But I guess it was necessary, right? Listen up, because people have died in our world. Like sometimes uh, you can really translate body shows literally up something. It has to be related to this place somehow. If you know something, tell us. A dead body? Whenever the fog appears? I know that if it's foggy on your side, the fog lifts here. It's really dangerous when the fog lifts. That's when the shadows get violent. Huh? Ah, I get it. Huh? If you get it, then explain it to us, damn it. If it's foggy on our side, it isn't in here. Shadows get violent? That's why I said to hurry back. It's dangerous when that happens. Okay, no more questions. I know you guys did it. You better stop right now. Okay. I've told you and told you we're not the ones doing it. I've about had it with you. Why the hell won't you listen to what we're saying? Uh, I'm just saying you might be the culprits. Uh, I'm just making sure. Who are you intending to make sure like that? What? You Man, this bear's dumb truck. nuts. What is this place anyways? It looks like a TV studio. Is something being filmed here? Hey, no. hey. Don't tell me. Is that weird show that being weird here? show. Weird show? Filmed? What does that mean? Uh, I'm asking if someone's been filming the people that get thrown in here. Eh? I don't get it. This world has always you been like, like fighting this. games? I no like fighting games, especially when I play with friends. Here. But I'm really bad at them. <laughs> I just bought a mush when I play with game with friends. And I don't I don't know how to do combos. I'm so bad. I'm I'm really bad. After finish Persona 4, try Persona 4 Arena. Is that like a sequel? Always been like this? What do you mean? Run that by me again? What? Why can't I tell him to shut up again? It's a sequel Only canon and you can play with friends. Oh, I told you that's cool. 
A sequel for Persona 3 and 4 at the same time. Oh, really? But then I guess I should play Persona 3 first, right? We don't know what these shadow things are, or what you are either for that matter. You keep telling us to prove our innocence, but you're the most suspicious thing here. Maybe you're the real culprit. Hmm. Shots fire. And what's with that stupid costume? I'd say it's time you showed your face. <laughs> oh. You didn't even open the zipper. What the hell are you? It, it's empty inside. <laughs> Me? The culprit? I wouldn't do such a thing. I just live here. I just want to live here peacefully. <sighs> okay. I'll believe that you guys aren't the culprits. But okay, thank you. I want you to find the real guy who did all this. You have to stop him. Promise me, or else I'm not gonna let you guys out of here. Hey, but I can't possibly now. You little. <laughs> this can't keep going on. My home here will be a complete mess. And then, and then, I. And in Persona 4 Arena, you see what happened with the Persona 3 cast. Well, that's really interesting. But again, I should play Persona 3. First, then, right? <laughs> Keep crying. What are you crying for all of a sudden? <laughs> Jeez, this thing's really weirding me out. Well, I could try. Uh, if you can play the reload version, that would be ideal, I think. If not, I can always try emulation. Wink, wink. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know, um, because when I when I stream Rhythm Heaven, which is for the Wii, it kind of lagged, like, it wasn't that bad, but my my model uh, kind of lagged. Uh, so maybe, especially the sound, the sound was really laggy. Um, so maybe uh, streaming PlayStation 2 games can be good i don't know it's a million times better than the other versions you like visual novels yep yep i do i actually stream some of them i played uh danganronpa on stream i played to the moon and finding paradise recently uh too and i'm planning on playing more visual novels the the thing is um they could be difficult to stream because it's based almost entirely on text and if people come in it can be a bit difficult because I will stop too much that's the issue uh, then play the version Persona 3 portable okay that's that's an option yep uh, Doki Doki Literature Club oh I play that too yep recently too Did you did you know Anis? Mysterious bar is asking you to find the culprit behind this. I'm going to eat Larkin from now. Okay. Okay, look up. Have a good lunch or whatever you are eating. <laughs> what? I yeah, I mean that I did play Doki Doki Literature Club too. So I was wondering if you saw that I streamed it. Hmm. Someone on the outside is throwing people into this world. Nah. Oh, okay. Mysterious bird seems serious about this. <sighs> hey, what should we do? You remember the words of the mysterious old man who called himself Igor? <laughs> you gently opened the door. Oh, goodness. That got me so good, man. That got me so good. I think... Did Okay, no, I did. I didn't actually clip that just because you know, but I literally jumped, man. I literally jumped. It seems you will encounter a misfortune at your destination, 
and a great mystery will be imposed upon you. Could this be the mystery that will be thrust upon you? What was the contract Igor spoke of? Will finding the culprit and solving the case be part of this pro promise? In any case, since you cannot leave the TV world on your own, there seems to be no other option. You're the only ones I can ask. Will you promise me? Yeah. I promise. Thank you! Damn bear. Damn bear. Practically holding a gun to our heads. But it's true that we came here to figure things out. So far, we're completely in the dark. Look for the culprit, huh? Bring it on. You got my word, too. Might as well introduce ourselves. I'm Yosuke Hanamura, and this is my buddy. The rink is just, yep. You got a name? Teddy. <laughs> Teddy. <laughs> Figures. Figures. But how are we supposed to find the culprit in the first place? I don't know. Oh, but I know where the last person came in. Oh. The last person? You mean Saki-senpai? I mean the person who came in and disappeared last time. I don't know the name. Fair. Well, I'll take you there. You might find clues. Oh, one thing first. You two should put these on. Glasses? What are these glasses for? As you put on the glasses, your vision instantly becomes much clearer. Whoa! The difference is like night and day. With these on, it's like the fog doesn't exist. They'll help you walk through the fog. Well, I've been here for a long time, so you can rely on me. Ah, uh, but I can only show you where the place is. You guys will have to defend yourselves. What happened to relying on you? Th there better not be any monsters, you understand? <laughs> there will be. We brought weapons, but I mean, they're more for show. We just got here. If it's so dangerous, why don't you do something instead of relying on us? Uh uh. No uh -uh. way. I've no -uh. got no muscles. Oh, oh, I'll give you guys moral support from a safe distance. Ah, uh, thank you. How's that sound? I love that idea. <laughs> Can't they really not fight? Try touching Teddy. <laughs> oh, I, I, I clicked that one by accident. <laughs> no! I touched you, bro. Is this thing for real? Uh, this is so lame. Or did you touch him? Shh, that's a secret. <laughs> Don't expose me like that. We swore to find the culprit, and this is all the backup we get? Oh, yeah. Can I ask you something? Who's this Saki Senpai person? Someone you know? <laughs> that doesn't matter right now. She's Anyways, <laughs> at least now we know Senpai might have been thrown in here. Maybe we can find more information too. Let's get moving. Okay. What? Wait! I think you're actually a turtle. What nice is this place. place? This is Persona it's just 5. Like the shopping district. No, this is Persona 5. What's going on here? Some weird places have appeared here recently. Things are getting so tangled. I, I don't know what to do. Uh, by the way, why are you standing so far from us? Gross is care. You better not be planning to hightail it if something does come up. <laughs> Of course yeah, sure, not. sure. I mean, um, I can't stand too close, you know. I get in your way. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Look at the booty. <laughs> I mean, I can't, I can't blame him. I already did say that I have a thick ass. <sighs> Man, they really went all out on this. But out of all the places in town, why'd they replicate this one? What do you mean? How should I know? This is reality for the one who's here. As usual, nothing you say makes any sense. But if this is our shopping district, we're not far from Saki Senpai's. Saki Senpai's what? Shop? Oh, true. She had a shop, right? But her parents. I knew it. This is the liquor store that Senpai's parents run. Oh. Does this mean Senpai disappeared here? 
What could have happened? Wait a second. They're here. On some zips. What? Shadows. I had a feeling they were going to attack. Oh. <laughs> the face. Got a sick card. Is this one of those Pokemon TCGs? Person. Oh, she got song. Okay, finally time for some Get gameplay. And listen. It's been three hours. Some shadows have weaknesses. If you can pinpoint that weakness and take advantage of it, the battle will be a lot easier. Okay, don't tell me. It's going to be really convenient and they are weak to the element of my persona, right? I can tell this one has a weakness too. Try stuff out and see what works. Okay. Yeah, shut up. Let's see if I am in the right here. Oh, critical. Of course. Not keep track of what attacks have what effects on enemies. Okay, that's a cool song too. Like me, hey, that's disgusting. Okay, 30 EXP, two soul drop. I don't know what does that do, but okay, thank you. Oh, wait, <laughs> don't lick me. Amazing, Sensei. <laughs> Okay, epic. I mean, he did lick me. Well, it did. I don't know what that is. I'm that disgusting. Rinku Susumu has faced his other self. He has obtained the facade used of oh, facade, facade, facade used to overcome life's hardships. The persona is Nagi. Whoa, what was that? It's a Nagi. Did I hear you say Persona? What was it? I I, I, I love how that's what stick with him. Like, bro, you just say Persona. How mind-blowing that is. Wow. <laughs> bro, you just said Persona. Ain't that crazy? I mean, what did you do? Hey, you think I can do it too? Yeah, sure, try Calm down, Yosuke. You're troubling Sensei. Sensei? S sensei? 
Gosh almighty, you're amazing, Sensei. I am one impressed bear. How does Teddy know it's all about this? I can't believe you were hiding such an amazing power. No wonder the shadows were scared of you. They were scared of me since when? <gasps> Are you the one who's able to bring people in? They into literally this world? attacked me. Yes. <laughs> That's what I thought. This is really something. Don't you think so, Yosuke? Dude, you call him sensei and then don't show me any respect? Bros jealous. Sorry. Bros jealous. Well, your support wasn't bad though. I got to give you some credit for that. And now he's playing cool. Huh? Really? He <laughs> <laughs> All right. You two keep it up, and I think we'll be fine from here on out. Now let's get back to the investigation. Oh, um, let's go to Persona Five Royale. Oh, we are not going. Okay. Ugh, I wish Janess would go under. Eh? It's all because of that store. Hmm. What the? What the? Ugh. I heard that Konishi-san's daughter is working there. Okay, I'm, I have to say, that boy sounded really hot. Wait, how was it? Here. Oh, I heard that Konishi-san's daughter is working there. She had no right to sound that hot. Well, literally, that not, it's not even there. Oh. I heard that Konishi-san's daughter is working there. Who is she? I need to know. Oh my, how could she with her family's business suffering like it is? The, oh yeah. This one sounds really hot too. Oh my, how could she with her family's business suffering like it is? But this one is just a mess. Oh, I heard <laughs> that Konishi-san's daughter is working there. Okay, I stopped. I still know. I heard their sales have gone downhill because of Juness. Stop it. That poor father. To have his own daughter working for the enemy. The enemy. Tekidane. What a troublesome child. Hey, hey, Ted. Ted. You're getting too close to him already. You said that this place is reality for those that are here, right? So. Does that mean this was Senpai's reality when she wandered in here? I only know about what's over here. Fine. Whatever's going on here, we'll find out ourselves. Oh. Wait, is that the Chug Yug from Fortnite? Damn it, not again. You begin to hear a man yelling. Saki, how many times do I have to tell you? Is that his father? Not her father? Is this Senpai's dad? You know what the neighbors say about you, right? Aren't you ashamed of yourself? You're the eldest daughter of a family who's owned this store for generations. Is it the money? Or did you meet some guy there? Just tell me why you have to work there of all places. Wow. I, I can't believe this. She seemed like she had fun at work. She never said anything like this to me. Well, people tend to hide their problems, you know. And everyone has their problems. I also have mine. You're telling me but I'm not telling everyone, you know. I tend, I tend to play pretend. Especially in Japan. Yeah, true. I've heard uh, the Japanese people tend to be like... Uh, very reserved. Is that the term? Like, they barely talk about their things. Well, I'm that kind of person too. I don't usually talk about my problems and I always put on a happy face for everyone. But that doesn't mean that I am not struggling, you know. Yeah. Just drink the chuck yak. These photos. Hey, is this? What is this? Hmm? It's the photo we took the other day with the other part-timers at Juness. Oh? Why is it cut up like this? And why not? Scrap of the photo shows Saki Konishi smiling. Just guess is standing next to her. Of course! 
I never had the chance to say it. Oh? Eh? Is that Senpai's voice? I always wanted to tell Hanachan. Oh? Huh? Me? Nah, he's he's going to get his heart broken. I can I can feel it. I can sense it. That he was a real pain in the ass. <laughs> of course. I was nice to him just because he was the store manager's son. That's all. True though, yeah. He He seemed like that one simp that that is always behind the girls uh, he likes. But he takes it completely the wrong way and gets all enthusiastic. What a dick. Like I don't I don't think she she wanted to say dip. <laughs> I mean, he felt really an annoying, honestly. But still, I think this is a very harmful thing to say. Who cares about Juness anyway? Because of that store, our business is ruined. My parents hate me. The neighbors talk behind my back. Of course, it's Juness' fault, not yours, for joining. I wish everything would just disappear. Bruh. It's a lie. This can't be. Poor man. Honestly. Senpai's not like that. I also know how it feels to have your heart broken. It's so sad. I feel so sorry for myself. Boo hoo. Hey, you didn't have to say that to yourself, just get. Actually, no. I'm the one who thinks everything's a pain in the ass. Two of them. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> Two, Two of them. Who are you? I, I wouldn't think that. <laughs> yeah, right. How long are you going to keep deluding yourself? <laughs> I say that before. He's delusional. Delulu. Screw the shopping district and Juness too. You're sick of everything, especially living out in the sticks. What does that mean? What are you saying? That's not true. I. You put on a good show of being carefree and happy go lucky because you're so terrified of being alone. The more, the merrier, right? You gotta be surrounded by people to block out the pain of isolation. Wow. And what's this about checking out this world for Saki Senpai's sake? Ha! I know the real reason you came snooping. Stop it! Oh? <laughs> Why so panicked? Oh? I thought I was just spouting bullshit. Or maybe I do know everything you're thinking. Oh? Why's that? Because I am you. Oh, I thought he was his twin. You just came because you thought it sounded like a good time. What else is there to do out in this shithole? Isn't it usual for twins to have like some dark aura or something like that and glowing yellow eyes i think that's mostly every twin right a world inside the tv now that's exciting you didn't have a single other reason for coming here did you oh okay now that may be true in a way but i don't really think he didn't care about saki like he was such a simp for her. It's not true. Stop. Stop it. You're just trying to act like a big shot. If all went well, hey, maybe you could even be a hero. And that senpai you were so sweet on, her death was the perfect excuse. Wow. That's not true. What are you? Who are you? Your evil twin. <laughs> I already told you. I'm you. Your shadow. There's nothing I don't know about you. Screw that. I don't know you. <laughs> you can't be me, you son of a bitch! <laughs> okay. Someone record this. He called himself a son of a bitch. He did. 
That's right. Say it again. Yeah, do it. You're not me. You're nothing like me. The phases. Yeah, that's right. I am me now. Oh. I'm not you anymore, see? I am you, he says. Josuke, you're a frog. <laughs> I am a shadow. The true you're a self. frog, Josuke. I'll crush everything that bores me. Well, you will have to crush the entire town then. Starting with you. Out of the way. Are you kidding me? Wait, isn't this like unfair? How long can you survive this? This one's much stronger than the last time. Yeah, I Be know careful. this, Teddy. Thank you, though. Whenever you feel threatened, just defend yourself. But how? I can't defend myself. Shut up. Oh, okay. Okay, so... Guard? When I'm alone, I can't guard forever. What am I supposed to do here? Ouch. Okay, analysis. This one's Kowalski, analysis. Okay. I can't keep up with this. Should I try to attack? But this won't do anything. What did this do? Oh, okay. Convenient. Rekugaya. Power carriage. Okay. Convenient. It's going to attack. Defend yourself. Ouch. Crap. Are you kidding? Okay. Oh. If I knew, I would have done this much earlier. That's not gonna work. Oh no. <laughs> it's guarding its weak point! Bros is scared. Okay, then. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, never mind. Okay, come on, keep going. Okay, um, not I'm not dealing that much damage, though. Am I? I don't know. Pain in the ass. <laughs> pain in the ass. Attack. Defend yourself. I know. You're getting to be a real pain. All right, I'm gonna crush you with everything I got. Okay. I would like to sh see you try. That, that's literally the same thing you've been doing. <laughs> Again. And I need to recharge. In fact, I'm going to use this turn. Wink you playing Persona? Saki, what are you doing here? You literally just died. <laughs> it's going to attack! Defend yourself! Okay. No, no, no. You're here, you're here. Thank you for coming, Saki. I have you into the stream. Thank you for coming. How are you doing? How is everything going? Uh, did he say he was gonna attack? You died, yeah. Saki just died. <laughs> yep, you died. <laughs> oh, hey, Lucas. You're back. Oh, 
<laughs> Where? Okay, this is uh, there's this character no named Saki who died. Here comes an attack! What a freaking pain in the ass! Get out of my way! I've been tired with the chorus. That's exactly why. You follow for Saki. Yep. Good job. Saki deserves deserves the follow totally. Come on. Did you finish it? What did you eat? You want more? And I need to... I need to... Recharge. Don't underestimate me! Oh, nice one. Okay, soul drop. <laughs> Even though I've been doing nothing. When are you going to go back to streaming, Saki? No pressure, though. Everyone has their... Moments, you know. Like if your BC is completely normal. There we go. Amazing, okay, level up. Something inside of you has changed. It's an Aggie has to level up. Oh, nice. My schedule is so full now. Uh, you will be more free, don't worry. By the way, uh, Saki, now that I think about it, you're not in my Discord server, are you? I... I... Yosuke, are you okay? Yeah. Yes, I am. Oh, what? okay. Never mind then. <laughs> I don't know why I thought you weren't. I'm sorry. Did you see, um, if you did, please don't say anything. Did you see what I announced the other day over there? You, you're not me. That thing came from you, Yosuke. You have to admit it, or it'll go berserk again. Yosuke seems a little time to accept it. You're still yourself, you have to be brave, everyone's the same inside. I don't know, I wouldn't say any of this in this situation, honestly. But you're still yourself. Myself. Yourself. Damn it. It hurts to face yourself. It does though. It's really difficult to accept your flaws. I just saw. I oh, okay. <laughs> I was so ashamed that I didn't want to admit it. Luca, you just joined the Discord server. If you if you saw it, don't say anything, okay? You're me, and I'm you. When you get down to it, all of this is me. The strength of heart required to face oneself has been made manifest. Oh. Yosuke has faced his other self. He has obtained the facade all used to overcome life's hardships. The persona Jiraiya. Isn't that this a Naruto character? Is my persona. When we heard Senpai, I wonder if that was something Senpai had been keeping deep down inside. Yosuke evolved. <laughs> Yosuke reached level 15. He evolving to Jiraiya. <laughs> <laughs> he was a real pain in the ass. Senpai. Huh. You know, Saki, the Senpai is you. <laughs> so. What a way to find out. Jeez, this is so embarrassing. Isn't that Jiraiya? Wait, isn't, isn't that Jiraiya? Jiraiya, yeah. His, his senpai is Saki. Hmm. If you weren't here, I don't know what would have happened. Thanks. And it's a pleasure. Okay, I can read that. It says okay. It, hey, never mind. Teddy. The character. Yep. Okay, I could read Japanese sake in one of the 
in one of the Could bottles. Could have been attacked by her other self here? Like how it just happened to me? I think so. Oh. The shadows here were originally born from humans. Sometimes the fog clears, then they all go berserk. Berserk? Just like guts? And you saw what happens next. A strong-willed shadow draws others to it, and a big mass of shadows kills the host. Yeah. So that's why people die when it gets foggy in our world. That's crazy. <sighs> Yosuke's pretty worn out. I mean, this world isn't made for humans. It's not comfortable for you here. I don't hear any more voices. I think we're done with this place. Let's go back. Well, okay. We are making progress. I, I hope I can reach the first dungeon at hey, first. Teddy. Like at least. You said that this place is reality for people who enter, right? So that shopping district and the weird room we saw before, did they exist because the ones who died entered this world and it became their reality? I guess what I'm trying to ask is, did those places form because of the people who entered this world? I don't know. It's never happened before. Damn. But that's probably where they were when the shadows attacked them. What's the same for them? This work killing the fog does lift here sometimes. The shadows get really violent then. I always get so scared I have to hide when it happens. I sensed people here twice before, but both of them disappeared after the fog lifted. So let's get this straight. Hmm. Senpai and that Yamano lady were thrown in here, and since they couldn't get out, they wandered around. After a while, that shadow thing came out of them. The fog cleared, it went berserk, and it ended up killing them. Imagine if, if the other two became Persona users. Does that sound right? So if I'd been here until the fog cleared, I would have been in much deeper trouble? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. You were lucky. Sensei and me were here with you. But you did nothing. Damn it. Senpai and that announcer. They were stuck here all alone. <laughs> you did nothing, bro. No one could save them. Yosuke. They disappeared when the fog lifted. But they were safe before that. No shadows attacked them. They attacked us, though. Maybe they're keeping a close eye on us. They might see people who investigate this place as... And it'll be dangerous. But we might be able to fight them. We might save people. Are you saying if anyone else gets thrown in here, we can save them before they disappear? Like how you guys just saved me? Oh. That seems to be the case. We need to find the culprit. We want to know is we track. It seems to be the case. Anyways, we need to catch the one who's throwing people in here and make him stop. Yeah, I'm finally starting to understand what's going on. Wow. Maybe you are not as dumb as I thought you were. Um, can I ask something too? No. <laughs> if shadows are born from humans, what was Teddy born from? You don't even know where you came from? How should we know? There's no Mama Teddy. I know some things, mostly about this world, but I don't know anything about myself. That's a lie. You knew you were a bear and that you were called Teddy. To be honest, I never thought about it until now. Are you serious? It's Monokuma. <laughs> it's Monokuma, but the non emo version. The clown version. It's Freddy Fazbear. It's it's the mix of them both. <laughs> no wonder we couldn't get a straight answer out of you. Imagine playing Dangarumpa and, and, and Monokuma just goes her 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 <laughs> Will you guys come back here? Of course. R really? Well, you're the one who said you weren't letting us out unless we do. Wait, are you implying Monokuma and Freddy had a son? Oh, that's right. Okay, I'll let you out. But there's one thing. I'll be waiting for you guys here. 
You need to come in from the same place every time so we can meet up. Convenient. And wait, what if I go come in from somewhere into else, this world but from a different TV? Here. You might show up somewhere I couldn't get to you. Then you'd be doomed. I see. Got it? Now I'm curious. Well, pretty much. Honestly, I'm I'm really curious. All now. right, can you show us the way out? Roger that. One exit coming right up. You could just l leave it there. You know? Yes, and it's Teddy. Cool. I mean, it makes we sense. We need to make sure there aren't any employees milling around out there. But it can't be because Teddy is empty inside. Freddy is not. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, go, go, go. Squish. Uh, hey, stop squeezing, you little. You little what? If you are afraid to say son of a bitch, you already say that, you know? <laughs> Out of context, Teddy X Josuke. Oh my god, <laughs> the, the shipping. Uh, I, I'm afraid to ask, is there fun fix about them? Most likely, right? Squeeze. So it seems. Huh? Chie? Whoa, what's with that face? Oh. <laughs> oh! The nerve of you guys! Oh, you're such morons! Morons? What do you mean, morons? It's not our fault that the rope got cut, you know? Why are you blaming us? You're being really mean oh, right now. Cut off. I had no idea what to do. And why is that our fault? I was so worried. Not our fault still. I mean scared stuff, damn it! And I hate you both! That has nothing to do with us. Bruh. I I think that might have kind of sort of been our fault. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Don't fall for that guy's like. Maybe we did go a little too far. It wasn't our fault. Let's apologize to her tomorrow. But we didn't do anything. <sighs> I'm completely wiped out. I'm gonna go home, soak in the shower for a while and get some sleep. I think I'm gonna sleep well tonight. Okay, that's good. He really fell for the guys like man. See you in the morning. And here the flute playing while walking home from Juness. Oh. Mm -hmm. Is that Jukiko? Is that Koyuki? Oh, are you surprised to see me dressed this way? My parents sent me out on an errand. And what does that have to do with anything? Oh, you have to dress that for the inn, right? Are you getting used to your new town in school? I like it here. It's cool. Really? I can go inside the TV, yeah. But it must be difficult moving to a place you know nothing about. Yeah, but I can go into the TV in Tokyo. I've never been out of Inaba, so I wouldn't know what it's like to transfer to a new school. Oh, are you getting along with Chie? Well, I mean, I always leave early, so. Well, I'm getting along. <laughs> she tried to gaslight like me into thinking I it was my fault to, uh, being stranded inside the TV world. Yeah, but we are getting along. <laughs> we are getting along. I'm glad to hear that. Chie is very supportive, you know. It's always her who gives me the little extra push I need. We had homeroom together last year, too, and I still remember how we cut class sometimes. What? Oh my goodness. You are such... I'm not gonna say that. 
Oh, <laughs> I should get going. I, I thought about tomorrow's it. Arrangements with our head chef. That was gonna sound so wrong. Our inn can't function without me right now. Um, I'll see you at school then. <laughs> okay. Evening. Dad's late. Oh, of course he is. Our next story is an update in our ongoing report on the bizarre murders occurring in Inaba. At around 7 a.m., a local high school that? student Saki Konishi was found dead in Inaba's residential area. Since the body was positioned similarly to the last victim, and since Miss Konishi was the one who discovered that body, police are proceeding under the assumption that this may be a serial murder case related to the death of Mayumi Yamano. The coroner's report has established Miss Konishi's time of death at around 1 a.m. last night. The body went unnoticed until this morning as a result of the heavy fog blanketing the area. Another incident. Dad won't be coming home tonight. So it seems. It can't be helped. Are you worried about him? I'll be here. I'll be here with you. Don't worry. Your I'll big okay. bro is here. Can you help me do some stuff around the house? Nanako seems to be very reliable for her age. Yeah, she. I mean, I. I think she's been forced to be like that. Like, she's alone all the time, so. Of course, she has to be more reliable than the usual kid her age. Amagi Inn, located upstream of Samegawa River, is the town's oldest historical landmark. Vacationers are known to travel surprising distances in order to visit its open-air, radium-rich hot springs. After the incident with Miss Yamano, the manager has stepped aside, leaving her daughter Yukiko to fill her shoes. Yukiko is on TV wearing a kimono. In other words, she's a manager who's still in high school. Why do they make such a big fuss over her? All the time they talk about the Amagi and they talk about her. Now that has a nice ring to it. Let's see if we can interview her. Excuse me! Okay, that's... That's a little bit too much. Hmm? Um, are you speaking to me? We've heard that you're the new manager. Is it true you're still in high school? Oh, well, I'm only filling in temporarily. Someday, though. That aside, <laughs> wow, you're looking gorgeous in Bruh. that kimono. You must have had a lot of male visitors. Uh, sir, isn't she a minor? Huh? No, um... Aren't you being a little bit of a creep? The reporter's rumbling goes further and further off subject. This is boring. <laughs> oh, I need to do the dishes. You decide to help out with the housework. Okay, good work. I was going to call you out for letting her do the dishes. Okay, you can now check your status by pressing the command menu button. The what? Oh. That's me. That's Yosuke. Okay, the person status. Garu Bash Dia. Okay, Dia, I think it's a healing one, right? Quest. Oh, I have no quests. I probably won't care that much about quests anyway. Alright. Wait. I want to save first. Okay. Alright, let's see what's on TV. <laughs> the, the Persona 3 calendar. Will something appear on TV? In other Inaba related news, meteorologists are predicting heavy fog throughout the year. Wow. The region has seen an abnormal amount of fog over the past few years, and the cause of the climate change is unknown. I wonder if Inaba 
uh, means something related to the fall. Whatever the reason, residents of the Inaba area should be extra careful. Our broadcast tonight was extended to bring you up-to-date news on the incident in Inaba. The time is now midnight. Nope. The image is there again. It seems that if the conditions are met, you can see it as many times as you want. A silhouette appeared. It seems to be a woman. It looks like she's wearing a kimono. Oh no. The image is so out of focus that you can tell who it is. What will happen if you touch the image of them on the midnight channel? Will you be able to touch the person on the screen? What? The image disappeared. Was that you, Kiko? You should speak to Yosuke and the others about this tomorrow. You decide to go to bed for tonight. Epic! Oh! <gasps> My wife! My wife! My wife and also Margaret. <laughs> Welcome. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Igor and my wife. Do not be alarmed. You are fast asleep in the real world. That's cool. I have summoned you within your dreams. So you're not real after all. It seems you've been summoned to the Belbet limousine. And so we meet again. Yep. This is a space that only those who have, in one way or another, entered into a contract may enter. That's my wife! In your daily life, you subconsciously heard the call to awaken, and you chose to follow the destiny of your inner voice, thereby enacting your glorious awakening to your power. Hold on to this! What is that? Wait, I can't see anything. Huh? Well, the key. Oh, I did, I did not see the key. Night forth, you are our guest in this velvet room. Your destiny will require you to hone your power, and for that, you will inevitably require our help. There is but one price for this assistance. You must abide by your contract and assume responsibility for all decisions you may make. Yeah, I haven't signed anything. Not yet. Very well. The persona you have acquired. Yeah. It is a side of you that shows itself when you face the world around you. Cool. Perhaps you can think of it as a facade of determination you wear to face various difficulties in life. Okay. Neat. Your persona ability, however, is that of the wild card. Compared to that of others, it is very special. Convenient. It is like the number zero. Empty. Yet holding oh, you infinite empty. potential within itself. You know what isn't empty though? Your nose because it's so long. I bet you have a lot of... Snot? I, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> empty? The persona ability is the power to control one's own heart. And the heart is strengthened through bonds. As you form bonds by becoming involved with others, your own social links will gradually develop. The power of these social links is what will determine your persona's abilities. Are you telling me that I have to socialize? Whoever watched me for enough time knows that I'm not good at that. Social links oh, are wife. necessary for more than strengthening your persona. I'm sorry, I'm just looking at you. At times, they will help light the way to the truth you're searching for. Where will your awakened power of the wild card take you? I look forward to traveling the road of your destiny together. <laughs> Till we meet again. Bye. Bye, wife. 
We'll miss you. Okay, so what next? Yo! Yo! You saw what was on last night, right? That's an off run, Adidas, over there. I couldn't tell who it was, but if someone's shown up on TV, we can't ignore it. Let's go check it out after school. Maybe Teddy can tell us something. Do I have to it answer? Turns out someone was thrown in again. School there really might be a culprit again? behind all this. Even if it is something about that place that's killing the victims, if someone's using that world as a weapon, that's unforgivable. We need to find the culprit, no matter what it takes. There's no way the police can do it. Who'd believe that the murderer kills people by throwing them into the TV? It has to be us. I want to keep my word too. Let's bring an You do it. You'd rather not. But there's no way you could refuse in a situation like this. Dude, I have to say, I was really hoping for your help on this. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if I could do it by myself. Oh, what a... You know, I tried sticking my head in the TV last night the way you did, and it actually worked. I think I can do that now because I have the same power. Persona, wasn't it? Could be that we got this gift from someone specifically so we could solve the case. Hmm. Igor, yes. Then again, you managed to go inside the TV and get your persona first. Oh, you are gonna complain? I feel like as long as you're with me, I can find the culprit and crack this case. Well, let's do our best. Yay. Even with so much mysteries rolling around, just keeps trying his harder to, to move on. You sense a fence steering of friendship between you and Josuke. Oh. Oh, I socialized. What is that car design? Thou or I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed with creating personas of the magician or Arcana. I barely had any time to read that. As you form a bond with Yosuke, you feel the power in your heart strengthening. You recall Igor's words. The persona of Yeah, shut up. I don't care about you. Social links. Is this bond with Yosuke what Igor was talking about? You have established the Yosuke Hanamura social link of the magician or Kano. Yosuke's determination in battle has been enhanced. Yosuke can now wake up and knock down a lie during battle. Epic. Useful. Hello. Did you have to look for us when you came into the class? Like, we are literally there. Um, about yesterday? We're sorry we worried oh, you. Shut up. Never mind that. Is Yukiko still not here? Oh, it was Yukiko, guys. Huh? Yukiko-san? Uh, no. At least, I haven't seen her today. Oh, man. What should I do? Hey, is that stuff you were talking about for real? You know, all that about how people showing up on the Midnight Channel is related to that other world. Oh, we were just talking about that. We're thinking of checking it out later. The person on TV yesterday? I think it was Yukiko. Do you think so, too? That kimono looked like the one she wears at the inn, and she wore it during I mean, that interview a few days was ago, too. It was too... Too much coincidence. Like, we saw her in the kimono, like, right before. And then... We watch the TV and it's like, oh, this person is wearing a kimono. <laughs> Funny, isn't it? I got worried, so I emailed her last night, but she hasn't responded. I called her earlier in the evening, though, and she said she'd be at school today. I... Calm down. We get the picture. And you still haven't heard from her? No. You summed up the information you gained in that other world for Chie. What's that supposed to mean? Wait, are you saying Yukiko was thrown in there? Pretty much. 
We don't know yet for sure. We should check to see if she's safe first. Give her another call. She's not going to pick it up. Yeah. No good. Her voicemail picked up. She, she's not answering. Are you serious? Then is Yukiko san inside that place? S stop it. Something must have come up, like an errand or something. Oh, or she might be helping at the end. She wouldn't be able to answer her cell if that's it. Yeah, but would she skip school for that? Hmm. I don't think well, so. I'll give the inn a call. Um, I've got the number here somewhere. Bang. Come on, Yukiko. Pick up. Or her father or her mother. Oh, is this Yukiko? Thank God she's there. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I see. Uh, uh, nah, it was nothing. Nah. <laughs> I'll email you again later. Eh? She was over at the inn. Oh. <laughs> she said they had a big group reservation and she Never had to help mind out. Then. Yeah. Oh, now that I think about it, this has happened before too. At least once a year. <laughs> she said she'll be at the inn tomorrow too. Hmm. For crying out loud, Yosuke, you got me worried over nothing. Oh, here it comes again. She was totally fine. Shut the fuck up. And you were all, is Yukiko san inside that place? <laughs> Okay, Chia, you need Sorry. to calm down. But there is a reason we thought that. Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah? It's justified. Besides, wasn't it you? The one that came here saying, Hey, I think that girl, that girl was Yukiko. Well, we thought people show up on the Midnight Channel because they're already over in that world. I mean, it makes sense, right? People show up on TV because they're inside the TV. Oops. But Yukiko-san's still here in our world. We might want to see what this is about. All right, let's meet up at Juness after school. I don't think I will make it to the first palace. Well, it's not a palace here, right? I think that's in Persona 5. Okay, I think that's more than enough about my sorry escapades. If I hadn't seen the place firsthand, I'd never have believed a story like that. Yeah, no kidding. Anyways, we need to know what's going on inside. I'm not going to stay. Yeah. Um. So many until. Customers around. Ten. I forgot there's a sale in the electronics department today. I'm going to leave like half an hour earlier. Like. I will. I will end the stream in like half an hour. How? By talking to that Teddy guy. I got it. Come here a sec. Try sticking your hand in and calling him over. I bet that bear's wandering around the entrance anyway. Hey, Chia, stand over here. Make a wall with me. <laughs> a wall? That's not going to work, you know. Come on, you're not blocking anything. People can see that clearly. <laughs> Something bet you. What's wrong? Look, Not she's bite, looking. You idiot. Dude, is that a bite mark? Are you okay? I'm fine. I'll, I think I'm gonna cry. <laughs> yes. Oh, come on. Don't cry. Sheesh, that stupid bear must have done it. <laughs> hey, you. We know you're in there. Oh, oh, is this a game? What? No, it's not a game. Can you sense anyone inside there right now? Okay, uh, real question here. This TV is in display, right? Uh, so it's for it's. You can buy that TV. What if, what if someone actually buys it? We won't be able to go there anymore. They don't even have to buy it. Mm, the people at Yunez may say, hey, let's change this TV, okay? Let's put some. 
uh, other TV, I don't know. I almost asleep. I'm a lonely little bear, like always. Are you calling my streams boring? Is this what you're implying here? <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. It's because they are very expensive. Yeah, but it's not a warranty of anything. Like, they could still buy it. Oh my goodness. Shut it! So there's no one inside? You're sure? I'm not lying. My nose is running as good as ever. Hmm. I'm gonna go warn Yukiko anyway. Since she'll be busy this weekend helping out at the inn, I doubt she'd go anywhere alone. But still. I wasn't going to use things yeah. boring. You'll walk with yeah, yeah, I know. Monday, don't right? worry. <laughs> and it was because I just finished eating. You should take a nap or something. Since uh, five years ago I started to get sleepy after I... Uh, apparently it's something that is very common. So it's completely natural. Sure, I'll go pick her up at her house. Maybe we'll find out more on tonight's Midnight Channel. Cross your fingers that this is all just a misunderstanding. What's your cell number? I'll, I'll call you when I watch it tonight. No. He asked for my number. All right. Don't forget to watch tonight. Was it really Yukiko who appeared last night? To need you need to watch the Midnight Channel again tonight. Okay. Looks like we found all we're gonna find here. And we've still got nothing that points directly to a suspect. Sus? We don't even know if this is a homicide. Oh, come on, please. Well, what else could it be? Exactly. There's no way a body could end up like that by accident. <sighs> I know. And since five years ago, I never sleep in the nights from high school, college. What? You stay awake the entire night? Are you are you for real? We haven't found the cause of death for the first Vic. Vic? A second one just like it. If this is a murder case, there's no doubt we're dealing with a single perp. But if that's true, what the hell's going on? You know, I thought at first this all spun out of that love triangle. No. That singer, Misuzu Hiragi, has a solid alibi. She was performing overseas, and her phone records prove it. And remember, the only reason the scandal went public was because Hiragi herself broke it to the media. No one would put themselves yep, under suspicion that Mine and they some had from others, the others, when they pay me enough. Oh! Do you get paid to make others homo works? Are you, are you that good at school? That's impressive, by the way. The fact that you can stay the entire night away. Got a point there. Same with Taro Namatame, her husband. No matter how much we shake him down, nothing links him to the murders. He's been working in the city for the past six months. Seems he was here recently because of the scandal, but he was swamped with work back home at the time of the incident. There are eyewitnesses and other evidence placing him at his office the night that Mayumi Yamano died. And we can't find anything that shows Yamano making contact with Namatame before or after her disappearance. You hear Namatame's career has also been killed stone dead? He's been fired from his position as secretary. He's practically as much of a victim as the Yamano girl. I don't know, I'm not yeah. following you guys. I... Then we have the second case, regarding Saki Konishi. She's the one who In the high school, Yamano's I made that very long nights without sleep. Don't buy wow. the killer shutting her up I could never. Moment. I tried to do it once, and I ended up falling asleep. She and I didn't well even realize. She reported the body, <laughs> and the culprit didn't hide her. Good it's luck like solving the case, drink you. Thank you, Luca. I'll try my best. The only other connection is that she attended the same I mean, school it's as still the daughter of the inn where Yamano So I don't really up. have any clues. But that hardly points to a motive. Coincidences like that are common in a town as small as ours. Yeah, I heard about that angle on the news too. 
What? Is the story about the inn out already? Bruh. Okay, I got it. How's this? Maybe there was something about the corpse that only Saki Konishi knew. And our perp killed her to keep whatever it was from leaking out. <sighs> Either way, all we can do now is keep investigating anyone involved with the victims. Our perp. It has to be someone in Inaba. Makes sense. Oh, is your detective's intuition at work? But I mean, of course, it, that, 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 the killer lives in Inaba, like, but it, are they going to come all the way from a different town just to kill a person? Two persons, or three even. Welcome home! The, the police here is kind of dumb. Okay, save it to save. Let's see what's on TV tonight. Nope. Good it was Yukiko after all. Tonight, Princess Yukiko has a big surprise. I'm gonna go score myself a hot stud. Welcome to Not a Dream, Not a Hoax. Princess Yukiko's hunt for her Prince Charming. And I came prepared. I've got my lacy unmentionables on, stacked from top to bottom. I'm out to catch a whole harem, and the best of the lot is gonna be all mine! Well, here I go! What? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what was that, man? And try not doing anything illegal, like having weapons or something like that, it will be difficult to explain to that. I'm going to buy a gun. I don't care. Hey, did you see that? I sure did. That was Yukiko-san for sure. It looked like her, and I mean, she even said her name. But didn't the stuff she was saying sound weird? Yeah, pretty much. And she looked like she was on some low-budget TV show. Was it like this before, too? What's going on? Calm down. Uh, okay, okay. Um, uh, uh, we need to get in touch with Yukiko-san first. Uh, crap, I don't know her number. Oh, yeah, I, I can just call Chie. Tomorrow's Sunday, so let's meet up at Juness first thing in the morning. You promised to meet up with Yosuke tomorrow. Yukiko-san more like Yukiko-san. What? <laughs> All right, we went to... <laughs> what are you talking about, Anis? <laughs> what are the implications of that comment? Oh, what are you trying morning. to say here? It seems that only Nanako is here. He left already. He said he's gonna be late. Damn. It sucks to be Nanako. If you leave, Nanako will be left all alone to look after the house. But I have to leave. On the other hand, you have important business with Josuke today. Are you going somewhere? Yes. I'll be fine by myself. Oh, okay. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> so the weather this weekend will be perfect for going out. As for next week's forecast... Oh, the sun's gonna come out. I should do some laundry. Nice. Uh, weren't you going somewhere? Yes, I am going. You decided to go out. Sorry for the hold up. I found some stuff we can use in the closet at home. Take a look at these. <laughs> what are you doing, Jessica? 
We've got our personas, but a golf club's not that reliable of a weapon. God you mean it isn't. So, which one strikes your fancy? The katana. Ah, you've got discerning taste. This is a Juness exclusive. Why do you sell katanas? The blade's fake though. I found some stuff in the closet we can use. This phrase is out of context. And the wink. <laughs> hey, hey, dude. I have something in the closet I want to show you. <laughs> Talking out weapons. As for yeah, me, this is no, this is completely normal. Hey, maybe both would be good too. Kind of like this. What are you doing, man? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Or like this! Why do you do such things in public, man? What about this? Isn't that literally the katana that I had in my dream? <laughs> two suspicious young males found. What One do you mean two suspicious? Weapons. I haven't Request done anything. Backup. Huh? Why do I keep being oh, blamed for I mean everything? No, 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 this, this isn't what it looks like. We didn't steal it. That's not the issue here. I guess that's no. not what matters. No. <laughs> Anyways, we're not doing anything bad. We're just two ordinary kids who like weapons. It, oh, uh, that doesn't sound right either. It doesn't. <laughs> Put the weapons down now. We'll listen to your story at the station. Huh? Oh, nice. Hands where I can see them, too. I said now. But, but this isn't... <laughs> Are you resisting an officer of the law? You're under arrest! Not only resisting, also threatening you. No oh, goodness. <laughs> My god. You didn't seem the type to pull a stupid stunt like this. You know what's been going on around town. We got men stationed everywhere. For God's sake. You're lucky I was around. Or this would have ended up on your permanent record. We're sorry. We show we. Wait, so the one that disappeared is the Amagi girl? Oh. Seems like it. That she's just a high schooler, you know. Could be that she decided to run away from home. Yeah, most likely. Hey, did he say Amagi? Then she really is. Hmm? Who's what now? Oh, uh, nothing. I'm sure you've seen on the news that there's an investigation in progress. We're sensitive about certain things. You're free to go. But this better not happen again. Yo, so Whoa, pardon me. That looks like huh? it's pretty hot. Aren't you the kid staying at Dojima-san's place? Yeah, that's me. I'm famous. Uh, can we ask you something? It's about Yukiko-san. I mean, Yukiko Amagi of the Amagi Inn. Did something happen to her? Huh? Oh, um, am I allowed to say? Probably not. Well, if you're friends with Miss Amagi, keep this between us, okay? You're pretty dumb. We got a call from Miss Amagi's parents yesterday evening saying they couldn't find her anywhere. Since it was the weekend, the workers at the inn were extremely busy, and no one saw Miss Amagi around that time. Oh, but that doesn't necessarily mean this is a case just yet. But, people have been turning up dead on foggy days, so we're really sensitive to stuff like this. By the way, did she say anything to you guys about maybe going through some hard times? Uh, hard times? Well, that announcer Miss Yamana was staying at the Amagi Inn before the first murder. I don't see how that adds up. Seems Miss Yamano had some harsh words for the manager about the staff's attitude towards guests. The stress of it caused the manager to collapse. And with Miss Amagi being the manager's daughter, <laughs> hard she times. Felt pretty strongly about the incident, you know? Stop. <laughs> Stop it. By the way, did Miss Amagi ever hint that she might be leaving? There the are house? a lot of double meanings around here. Because if not, there's been some theories floating around that she's laying low for some reason or another. Ah, crap. I think I've gone too far. You didn't hear that, okay? Okay, I did not Adachi, hear anything. what the hell are you chatting with civvies for? And where's my coffee? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. 
sorry. I got it right here. Psst, forget I said anything, please. You're gonna get fired, little bro. Hey, does that detective think that Yukiko-san? There you are! Oh, hi. Jeez, what are you guys doing? Oh. I've been looking everywhere! What can I use a katana in public? Uh, well, there was a slight misunderstanding. We'll tell you about it later. Anyway, something's up with Yukiko-san. Huh? You know already? I kept calling her so, but she didn't pick up. So I went to her house, and it turns out Yukiko really did disappear. I guess we've got no choice but to go now. But that aside, the cops are saying some weird stuff. Apparently Yukiko-san's mom collapsed because that announcer lady bitched her out. Wow. They think that gives her a motive. And the fact that the announcer died right after makes her even well, more suspicious. Well, at least that was fake. Oh, was him? That was the issue. <laughs> what? They think Yukiko did it? <gasps> what the hell is wrong with them? Why can't they Dude, just snap give us our fake weapons? Yukiko's the victim here, damn it, not the suspect. But we need to save her. We need to save her. Right. That's the important thing. Yeah. With the police totally on the wrong track, we've got to handle it ourselves. I'm going to. And that's final. I'm going to save Yukiko no matter what. Are you going to be all right? Man, they just confiscated our weapons. We can't go in empty-handed. Weapons? Oh, I know just the place. Come on. We're going to save our witches. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> Oh, nice place. Why is there a shop like this in the town? Why? What do I need Here the armor are. for? What kind of shop is this? Uh, metalworks, I guess? They sell all sorts of metal crap, like katanas and stuff. K a katana is not a metal crap. Doesn't that seem weird to you? Why would you know about a place like this anyway? What do we first in the main street of the town? Oh, I get it. You watch one too many kung fu movies and... It's not that at all. I overheard some guys in our class talk about it. They said this place sells weapons and armor. It's literally in the main street of the town. Here, this one looks good. But it might be too heavy. I don't know, Chie. I still think it's too dangerous. I know how you feel, but... You don't! You don't know shit about how I feel. Yukiko might die from this for crying out loud. Are you forgetting that Josuke's girlfriend literally died just now? Like, literally just now? I'm going, and that's that! Oh, or hi. Be fine. My reflexes are second to none. Hey, listen. I'm not kidding around. You don't know what it's like in there. If you're not gonna listen to our warnings, we're leaving you here. If you insist on coming, just make sure you have something to protect yourself. All right. Righty. But man, what should we get? Hey, Octana. are you picking out something for me too? You're our main asset in battle right now. So I think you should choose whatever makes it easiest for you. Katana. Oh, nice. Thank you. I got my stuff all picked out. How about you guys? You know, if we wear this stuff around town, we'll just get picked up again. Yes. But it's not like we can waltz into Juness with a sack full of gear and expect no one to notice either. Get him a butter knife. <laughs> okay, I will. Why not conceal real weapons? A real katana. I don't think people would notice. Well, okay, it depends. Let's try that. All right, let's split up and get ready. The store will be crowded until the afternoon sale ends, and if we both who can't together, really kill someone, just suspicious. what I wanted. <laughs> then I'll see you guys at the Ju. Shut up. 
Can I buy already? Okay. Okay, let's see. Imitation katana. Okay. Mr. Daidara is very good, dude. Crap. <laughs> okay, what about the armor? Oh. Okay, let's keep myself safe. And screw you, Josuke. <laughs> Okay, let's talk. If you want something special, bring me your own materials and I'll try to use them for you. I always like seeing new things and trying new techniques. So bring me some rare materials that I've never seen before. If you do, I can make you some really cool stuff. When choosing what to create, the number and type of materials varies. If you bring me the proper materials, I can use them to create some fine pieces of art for you. But what I make is up to me. I am the artist here, after all. I'll be expecting some praise too. The praise is uh, the money I give you. Basically. Oh. There's a bizarre door, door before you. That leads me, leads me to Persona 3. It seems the others can see the door. So, it finally the prices are bringing me new material. Now, if you'll give me a moment of your time. No. Okay, I think I'm forced to. Okay, never mind then. I'm running out of time, by the way, so. We have been expecting you. The catastrophe that has headed your way. It has already taken human lives in its approach oh, really? towards you. Okay, that's cool. That's convenient. But you have nothing to fear. You already have the power to fight against it. It seems that the time for you to use your persona has come. Finally. <laughs> and also in rainy days, he gives you a discount. Oh, really? Your persona ability is that of the wild card. Oh, hi, wifey. If you strengthen your bonds properly, their power will help you overcome any ordeal. Our role is to facilitate that. My contribution is to give birth to new personas. By mixing together multiple persona cards, I can transmute them into a new form. No, this, nice. in other words, is the fusion of personas. You have the power to hold multiple personas and to use them accordingly. When you defeat an enemy, the seeds of possibility you You're attain too much, will man. appear before you as cards. At times, they may be hard to grasp, but you must master your fear and reach out to them. When you obtain new cards, please do not hesitate to bring them here. Okay. If you have been developing your social links, then your persona will gain even more power. They will be one of your chief sources of strength. You would do well to take this to heart. You call that you have the magician social link with Yosuke. It seems that when a persona of the magician or Kana is fused, that persona will gain even more power. Nice. The tome you see in my hand is the Persona Compendium. Okay. Registering the personas you hold will allow you to recall them at any time. Okay. Please see me when you wish to use it. I want to see you every day. Oh, and one more thing. I would like to introduce a new resident of the Velvet Room, who will be helping you on your journey. Hey. <laughs> Hi, I've seen you before. Marie? Marie? Yeah, I can hear. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Marie. The girl seems so friendly. Well, what? You feel that like you've met her somewhere before. 
Why are you here? Dino. It doesn't matter. Okay. Nice explanation, Excuse thank you. Her. This is Marie. Her soul is still very young and... Shut up. Don't tell him any more about me than you need to. Hey, don't tell that to my wife. Don't say that. As you can see. Hey. She may be brusque at times, but please understand that she is only an apprentice. And forgive her for her impoliteness. <laughs> Wait. Mary maybe looks like an eager, but it's just a tsundere. <laughs> well, that's perfect then. For some reason, uh, Twitch was like, oh, e-girl. Marie will be dealing with skill cards. That's cool. Using these cards will allow you to provide your personas with bonkin. new powers. No, no, Bonkin. <laughs> He's nice. Also, I am sure she will help you form a bond between yourself and the outside world. Okay, but what about forming a link between... With nature and civilization, huh? Marie will That's contact my, you at a later date. My job. Please feel free to speak with her here when you wish to use her services. Can I leave? <laughs> Do you Shut up, my man. To you I have to end this stream. The coming year is a turning point in your destiny. If the mystery goes unsolved, I meant precisely what I said. Defeat in battle is not the only way your journey may come to an end. Please do not forget this. I already did. I'm sorry. What did you say? When next we meet, you will come here of your own will. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Finally. I look forward to it. Until then, farewell. Bye-bye. Okay, time to save. And let me change the screen. Yep. Whoop. Oh, chat gone. <laughs> Well, anyway, I had a lot of fun. Honestly, I'm really liking and I'm really enjoying Persona 4. By the way, <laughs> you don't have to be so mean, Anis. <laughs> uh, well, anyway, anyway. Um, I had a lot of fun. I have to say that I will be starting a one week hiatus, like now. Like, I won't be streaming at all next week. Uh, so I'm really sorry about that, but I really need to gather some energy, okay? <laughs> no, don't bong me! <laughs> I really need to, to gather some energy, okay? And one week of holidays is going to make me a lot of good, I think. And I promise you I will try to uh, bring some... Mm, some clips to YouTube and maybe some other content, okay? And once I come back, I promise you exciting things, okay? I promise. Stop bunking me! <laughs> Stop it! So anyway, um, thank you guys so much for coming. I hope you enjoyed the stream and see you after my break, okay? See you, everyone! Bye-bye! Let's keep having fun targets. Bye bye. Yum.